too late.
I'm hearing myself again. And you are hearing me twice. Well, not anymore. New Fixed. critical hits boost. Barton the Slayer just hey. boosted Deus uh, Ex. Okay, uh... It is better to reign in hell than to serve in heaven. Yeah, do your boosts now, because I won't be able to do the boost during the game. Any boosts that are that come in once I start the game will be done after the stream. Ooh, wow. 634, right. Yeah. <laughs> almost off the shares, almost off the shares. So, uh, hello QP, Parrots, uh, Barden, Malk, Nebuka. New critical hits boost. Barden the Slayer just boosted shadows. You're not at the most like in the skin, Ranger. not... Turn not using scum another direction so you use scum be scrutinized as though by some ridiculous divining rod did you use scum to play milk okay so deus ex um 12th of march takes the top quiescent pandemonium just boosted vampire shadows of um New Vampire. Boost. Quiescent Pandemonium just boosted Temple of Elemental Evil. 18th of March. Temple. Did I get some burns? No. I didn't go out. I don't know. I took a hot shower. Maybe. Maybe I burned myself. Oh, joy! Hey! Nebuka has been gifted a sub by Barden the Slayer. Pardon. Thank you for gifting us up to Nebuka. Thank you so much for the support. Welcome back in Nebuka. Welcome back to your rightful place as a sub to this channel. No, you mean you don't use it. Ah, I see. Yeah, uh, scum doesn't doesn't work. I mean, doesn't work properly. I mean, scum isn't supported to begin with. The stable versions of scum VM do not support Mankellen 4. New critical hits boost. But um, just boosted Diablo too. There are developer versions which I was using, which caused all the troubles we had last stream, I believe. So yeah, uh, let me explain. Last time I I was using the Steam installation files on a developer version of ScumVM, and uh, you have seen what problems we had. We it started with graphical glitches with the New characters. Paraguay's so, just boosted Dragon disappearing Age from the screen. Dragon Age 17. Ooh. What the heck? Are we going to have Disco Elysium 32? Mm. New critical hits boost. Paraguay's <laughs> just boosted Might and Magic 52. What, what are you doing? Are you okay? Are you fine? <laughs> What's happening there? <laughs> I don't follow. Anyway, uh, so it started with some graphical glitches and um, new critical hits boost. Nebuka just boosted Plan Escape Torment. Then it got worse. Some new some bugs started boost. happening. Quiet hey, Johnny. Hey, hey. Just boosted Hello. 69. Good to see you. Revenant nice. sixty nine. New critical hits boost. Nebuka just okay, boosted I... Fallout two. <laughs> I cannot follow. Slow down. Slow down, champions. Uh, Revenant sixty nine. And uh, Fallout 2. Thank you, thank you, man. You are the only one who who care about me, you know? Who really love me. Nebuka is the New only one who cares about Nebuka me. Just and boosts MW Fallout. And Nero into Nice one. Nice. So Catmas's nomination is getting some extra support now, which is great to see. So, uh... So some start some bugs started happening. Uh, you might have caught us not being able to change screens, and then finally, our save game was afflicted by a bug, which allowed us, which this allowed us to uh, switch focuses on items. So we were stuck on one character, and we couldn't focus on anything else. And basically, the save game was corrupted, and it was unusable. Uh, so I had to end the stream early, and. Then, after the stream, I installed, um, you bet that if I had any doubts about how popular the new critical system would be, <laughs> those doubts have not been thoroughly dispelled. No, no, I, I had no doubts anyway. <laughs> I'm very well. Weekend is going fine. Yesterday I rested a lot. 
and today is is, an, is going to be nice, I think, unlike last Sunday where we had a problematic stream. So uh, after the stream last Sunday, I installed the game on GOG and I installed the virtual software render called DG Voodoo. So by using DG Voodoo, you are basically rendering the game not by using your graphics card because the game does not recognize my graphics card for some reason uh, but you are using uh, the software itself to render so it goes around the problem and it uses DirectX yeah the game turned out to be unexpectedly good which made the stability problems much more frustrating I agree I felt the same thing I, I didn't expect much from the game last Sunday and I, I found out it's a lot of fun and then we start having the problems and I was, oh crap. Anyway, uh, I ran the game like that and I did everything we did on stream. Uh, I mean, I came to the point where we left off and I had zero problems, zero bugs, zero crashes, uh, no problems at all. So I think, I think we are fine. I cannot say that nothing's going to uh, go wrong. That we are not going to have any bugs later in the game but so far at least we we have had none i could enable the movie subtitles i can set the volume levels in more detail which is something weird i don't know why scum didn't allow that but the method which worked best for your pc was the gog version which comes prepatched to 101 101, 1.1, then I changed the launch options to limit the game to single CP core. Then you limited the game to 15 FPS and that seems to run fine. Yeah. Uh, the biggest problem with my setup is my graphics cards cannot be recognized by the game. I know, I know uh, some graphics cards, I think some Nvidia cards, uh, the game still recognizes. Uh, but my cards, uh, for some reason, the game does not recognize it, so there is no way for me to run the game without an additional launcher like this DG would do. Or, uh, or there is another one called, I think, Escape from Monkey Island Launcher or something, or Scum. So Scum didn't work and I, I'm using the second best now. <laughs> exactly so uh yes so if there are no more boosts i am we can say goodbye to this screen and i think it's time to jump into the game how are you all i hope you are having a fine sunday so far as well and continue to your boosts are done i think most people who regularly boost have boosted okay now Come on. Come on, game. You see, in this version, for some reason, we have uh, more detailed volume options. The other version did not allow this much uh, resolution somehow. I don't know if it's a scum thing or it was a patch version thing. No more boost, time to roost. Steam version is 1.0. Yeah, that could be that could be the case indeed. Alright. So, so uh by redoing what we did off stream, by coming to where we left off, I accidentally sold the game in two different places. I know it it sounds bullshit, I know, but it is exactly the case. And you will see. How I accidentally sold it. I'm going to explain. We had trouble with two with the controller, absolute pain. Yeah, I'm using good old keyboard. The prior version was like an early Russian space car. It had a button for on and a button for off. And all the buttons didn't work. <laughs> Alright, so uh, the first. The first way I solved the puzzle, I solved Dave? Yes. one of the puzzles, accidentally. So, um, when you ask for this guy... Wait, which one was it? Uh, 
Oh. And I still need to find some St. Swithin's Day gift. So when you ask for a free prosthesis... I'd like to have another one. Can't get enough of it. Once upon a time, there was a pirate named... The guy starts telling you a story and you choose names, right? So apparently the free prosthetic type that you get depends on the answers you choose. So there are multiple ones, which I think you are supposed to pick up every single kind. I don't know. That's what I'm going to do anyway. So we, we had gotten the skin on stream. And when I was quickly playing through the same parts, I chose the first ones and I got something else. And I realized that is a thing. So that is how I accidentally sold one of those. Jerry? Jerry! Jerry had his eye on a pirate princess named... So, now I'm going to try every combination, so bear with me. Mindy? Mindy! Sadly, Mindy's finger was already wearing the engagement ring of a bounder named... Fred? Yeah, Fred. Well? Well, what? What happened? Uh, the end. What a dread... That story's worse. I know. Here's your... What is it? It's a Bumbleweenie M-Class artificial liver. They were recalled a few months back. <laughs> uh, I couldn't handle the grog? Just the opposite. If they didn't get a constant supply of hard alcohol, they broke down. So if there's any rhyme of reason, rhyme or reason to why you get the organ you get, I don't know. So we tried one, one, one. one. Jerry? Jer Jerry had so his when you choose on Jerry, a pirate princess he named... says I. Mindy? Mindy. Sadly, now when you Mindy's pick Mindy, finger was he says finger. Wearing the so let's go with Ned. Ned. Ned, that's it. Where can you get one of those livers? I don't know. Well, where On what? Lucre Island. What happened? Oh, they all died okay, of liver disorder. Okay, this is liver again. The... What? You... Again liver. So 111 and 112 is liver. So 4, 5, 1, 1. Jed, that's what? Three. Well, where? What? Happened? Oh, again, liver. What okay. What is it? It's a. <laughs> it's a one. Two. One. Well, where? What? Happened? Oh, they all they again, liver. Huh. What is it? Well, well, what happened? Oh, they again, they were. Okay, maybe the, this works. What is it? Differently it than I imagined. Or maybe it's the, the first one that matters or something. So, one, two, three. Well, well, what? What happened? Eventually, she followed her heart. So, one, two, three is a heart. The what? What is it? That's a... One, three, one. Well, where? What happened? Eventually, she... What Again, hearts, huh? What is so it? So, we had five livers. What? One, three, two. Well, where what? What happened? Eventually she followed her heart. What? Again, heart. What is it? That what? One, three, yeah. three. Well, where what? What happened? Eventually. The okay, it's hard again. What is it? You Let's start with two. Larry? Two one Fred? one? Yeah. Well, where what? What happened? After many years Heads. of plotting. Okay. What, you... what is it? That. Hey, honey. I plan on fixing that. Yeah, I, I should have. It was a new one. I shouldn't have skipped. What? Um, no, I chose the wrong one. Can I go back? Let me go back. Fred. I don't very much like liver what either. I don't like the taste of uh, lamb liver. Liver. Hey, hey, Sangnef. Hello. Good to see you. 
Yeah, brute force. So two, one, two. Well, what happened? After the again, head. Worse than the last. I know. What is it? It's for pirates who've lost so many ears, eyes, and noses that they prefer to start all over with a brand new head. How do you plan on duplicating the intricate thought process of the pirate brain? I plan on fixing that in my first patch release. <laughs> you already I did. Well, I'm sorry, but I. So what if? What? I mean, I don't want to make uh, assumptions and miss one. Larry. Larry. La so let's go with two, two, three. Well, well, what? What happened? Neither of them had the guts, guts to go okay. through with the wedding, so she turned her past the. What a dr that story! I know. What is it? That oh, I. Oh. Your ex made you cook liver for him. You died inside a little. Why? Wow, it's not that bad. How did you cook it, though? It also depends on. Liver of what? Was it human? <laughs> I hope not, <laughs> because that that would kill me a little inside. Well, more than a little. Half liver. Yeah, it shouldn't be too bad. I don't know. Maybe, maybe, maybe I'm used to it. That's why. I like can't get what. So let's go with three, one, one. Well, well, what happened? She decided stomach. that she couldn't stomach the thought of being the egg. What a dreadful story. You really should leave the storytelling to the professionals. Yes, I oh, know. Um, Here's the your free experimental figure. prosthesis. What is it? That's a factory model. If they ever can figure out how to keep the acid from leaking out, they'll sell millions. Don't worry, this unit's empty. Two organs served inside another organ. Which organs in what organ? So, <laughs> it would make a lot of difference, right? Uh, what? Let's go with three. Three, three. Well, well, what happened? All three of them became but. the butt of a very naughty limerick. The end. What a dreadful story. That story's worse than the last one. I know. Yeah. Here's your free experimental prosthesis. What is it? This is a noble experiment that never quite worked. A team of French proctologists decided to attack the problems faced by pirates. I don't think I've ever eaten butts. stomach. No, Some wait. had their butts I shot have. off in battle. Others had worked their butts off. We'll still have to everyone surprised. But why? I like lamp hearts. I've never heard of X. So, um... I got seven different organs, I think. How many See you are later. there? So we have skin, liver, hearts, heads, guts, stomach, butts. I wonder if there are more. And I don't know what to do with these anyway. You couldn't eat eggs, so you tried and couldn't. Yeah, I didn't want to. It's some sort of doc. The name on it says Adeline A. Apricot. It has all sorts of useless information, such as prosthetic prescriptions, oh. address, phone number. Adeline A. Apricot. So A A A. Okay, that that must be something. It appears to be some. It appears to be some sort of high tech file retrieval system. So Bunny is A, right? The name on it says Harry D. Back. It has all sorts of useless information, such as prosthetic. Pro Harry D. Back. Okay, this doesn't make sense anymore. Yeah, I don't think I would be able to eat that black pudding. I've heard of it, but doesn't 
Doesn't sound very good to be honest. HDB, so that was HDB. What if if we go palm 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 or something? The name on it says Eric G. Fungdigosmac. It what? has all sorts of useless information, such as prosthetic okay. prescriptions, oh, we are, address. We are going to come back to this. So let me show you which other puzzle I accidentally solved. Wait, I thought I could... I could go to the chess guys from here. Can I not? Okay, maybe not. What? My keyboard volume button is broken. It sometimes tries to raise or lower the volume by itself i'm assuming it's the keyboards button okay so uh this puzzle um so we can when he's making his move we Brittany, can look out <gasps> Brittany, where? distract the guy and he drops the piece <laughs> Ooh, good move so don't I tell me accidentally did this too. that you bet your bonny butt I am. You unbelievable jerk! Who was it told me that rules are rules, Tabo? Fine. You wanna see a move? Here's a move! Hello? So? Game? Yeah, it is the name of the channel. What the heck? No. Did you get stuck? Come on, but why? I should have saved. Uh, okay. Oh, is it the ex exits? No, it doesn't. So I, I change it to Z, I think. But this worked off stream. I know, I know it works. So O or Z. You call that a move? Okay, it's... this is a move. You can't do that. Oh yeah? Who's gonna stop me? Gainsy and pig. Doily sniffer. Called. Yeah, Lard we can pick up the Okay. All right, no. cries over it. Let's, let's have a save. So these are the two things I accidentally sold off stream. Mm, so we have lots of prosthetic organs and the clock. It's a chess clock. Oh, that that was something something else. Yeah, a dialogue that I. I didn't make on on stream, and then I remembered that I should. Um. Yes. What is it? We're quite busy. Have you guys figured out how to save my mansion yet? We're almost done. But we need one more document. The deed to the Marley Mansion. Gee, that's a coincidence. Why? Well, Grandpa Marley's letter mentioned something about the deed being in the Lucre Island Bank, so I went over to get it. And? And while I was there, a no-nose pirate robbed the bank, stole the deed, and framed me for bank robbery. That's horrible. Out. 
outrageous. Do you need representation? No, thanks. I trust the courts to recognize my inherent innocence. <laughs> I'd like to sue someone. A lawsuit? Did someone say lawsuit? That sounds intriguing. Who do you want to sue? And why? <laughs> Can I sue Inspector Kennard for false arrest? I suppose. Possibly. Maybe. Well, the media would love it, but Kennard is... How shall we put it? Poor. Broke. Bereft of funds. You'd have better luck getting blood from a turnip. A small turnip. A small, dead turnip. I... Who? And... I want to sue the twerp who's hurling boulders at my mansion. First things first, Mr. Threepwood. We have to stop him. Before we can sue him. I... Who? And... <laughs> Let's sue the electronic gaming industry for Dracula. Let's sue the electronic gaming industry for driving hardware requirements to ridiculous heights, even for simple adventure games. What? I have no idea why I just said that. Uh, I'd like to sue the ghost pirate LeChuck for emotional distress. We can't sue a ghost. That'd be unethical. Immoral. And besides, there's no money in it. Immoral or immortal? I'd still like to sue someone. Who? And okay. Never... Um. So these are jokes. Well. Stop it. Yeah, a bunch of stuff. I don't know where to use these, any of these. I don't think they'd like that. That's curious. It doesn't seem to be moving. Follow the money. It doesn't That's seem to move. It's a chess clock. Follow the money. If I took it, their clients wouldn't have anything to sit on. We'll have to convince the For a bunch of high priced lawyers, their furniture leaves something to be desired. I'll give them personal injury. Can we use the bots on? Small That's barrel. just plain sick. What? We'll have to convince the court it's not. Otherwise. It's fine. I don't if we can make a drum solo. <laughs> Let's not try that. We'll have to convince the court otherwise. Hmm. Let's see what's inside. Hey, get away from that. Uh, oops, the money. Sorry, I thought there were complimentary mints inside. We'll just buy all the expert witnesses. Hmm. Hey. Uh, two words, boys. Maybe. If... Is there another? Like. Fire railway. Personal injury. Okay. Where are my briefs? No, we really need to file. I don't know what to do. I do. I have no ideas how to proceed. All those prosthetic organs. Why can't we use them? Why, hello there. Oh, why do you... Oh. Sorry you lost your job. Oh, it's all right. I didn't like working at that bank much anyway. I've always really... <laughs> Me too. Maybe we could start it. Mm, I'm looking... Parody? Then why were you wasting away at the bank? I was making... I think I have been already a whole island, yeah. Guess I needed... Oh. Well... I mean, there are a few things that... I know I have to do, just... I don't... I have no idea how. For example... I have to find the address for the Nono's guy. And I think it's it has something to do with the file retrieval system. But I don't know if I have to find the monkey or if I have to solve that. Wait, what's this? It's just too heavy for me to pull open on my own. Where is George Stobart's tool? Hey! 
Ah, okay, this works. Crud. I dropped the sword into the sewers. Oh well. Now it's a broken and very stinky sword. Okay, um. Wow. Well, not to mention smelly. Phew. On second thought, I don't think I want to go down there for any reason. <laughs> so we're not going down there? So. We just picked up the manhole? There's something scratched into the bottom of this. It says Mindy loves Jed. But Mindy scratched loves... out right next to that, it says Harry loves Mindy. What a weird place to profess your love for someone. Mindy loves Jed. Harry loves Mindy. Let's get that story. <laughs> Hi. Do you know what this tool is used for? Exactly. Mindy, Jed. Wait, what was it? It's the official. I don't think that would help anything. What am I doing? There's something scratched into the. It says Mindy loves Jed. Mindy it's Jed's right Harry. Once a Harry, Harry, Harry a Mindy. Mindy, Mindy, sadly, Jed. Jed, that's right, Jed. Well, well, what happened? Realizing that beauty skin. was only skin, the what a dread. You really should leave this. I know. He what is it? This is something special. It's a sample of my newly created ultra stretchy one size fits all prosthetic skin. Yeah. But this is the first one. With just a few square feet of this miracle substance, a pirate can replace all the skin he's lost during a lifetime of sword fighting, knife fighting, keel hauling, and the occasional flogging. And it comes complete with a set of tiny hooks for easy attachment. I repeat, you already gave me one. I did. Huh. So maybe I didn't have to pick up all of those. Maybe it was just the skin that was the important one, and the answer was under the manhole, but I somehow accidentally chose the correct answers on stream last time. Could be. But can we understand this person? So three bunnies is AAA. Does it have something to do with the first letters? Let's go with three pumpkins. The name on it says Jeffrey J. Jumper. It has also So again, three same letters. J J J. I don't know if it's if that's a clue or a joke. The name on it says Nathaniel O. Surge. It has all sorts of useless NOS. information. NOS. Hmm. I wish they'd stop staring at me. I wish they'd stop staring at me. I've had enough of touching other people's eyeballs, thanks. So how can we use the skin? What would it be good for? I have an idea for the duck. I think we are going to use it to scare Nono's pirates when we find him. Because his story seems to include a duck biting his nose off. And then he was also scared by a walking stick with a duck on it at another time. Ledger hammer with it. Prestige card. So we have this hand. 
Can we make make a person from all, all these pieces? Those things really don't go together. 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 I think they would. You just have to be creative. I don't think that would help anything. So let's try. Um, I, don't, I, I, I have not been able to learn the buttons. Well, that didn't seem to work. 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 I don't think that would help anything. Wait, are you going to make haggis? <laughs> we can put liver and heart into this stomach, maybe. Would it, would it work? Well, that didn't seem to work. Ah, wrong button again. No, no, no. Savory. Ugh. Wow. So your your food discussion gave me a clue. My current liver is functioning just fine. Was that intended? Yeah, how, how was I doing this? Ugh. Collection of experimental prosthetic parts. <laughs> I just did. <laughs> See? It's kidney and hearts in a stomach. So let's put butts too. Uh, and guts. Uh, okay, maybe it's not Haggis. Uh, <laughs> what is this? What is this? This looks somewhat like human. No, this is a collection of experimental ah, prosthetic devices. Sorry. I don't think that would help anything. Sorry, Guy Rush. Whoops. Well, that didn't seem to work. What? Why? That's not Agus, that's Bob. Uh... I think we are missing something. Like, we are missing a buddy. I don't have the nerve to use. I don't have. Uh... Wait, does it matter which order we use it? Ah, it's it might actually. Whoops! Well, that didn't seem to work. So we don't we don't have a body. Maybe stomach is the next one. No, we would need lungs, right? Okay, maybe there are other other pieces. Let's let's go finish all that brute forcing. No, 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 not here. So, where did I leave off last time? I did. The name on it says, Adeline. it has all. Yeah. I'm not. Oh, that, of course, without. So I did everything with Jerry. I started Larry. Larry? Larry! Larry wanted to win! Did I try 2 1 and everything? 2 1 3? Let's then go with 2 2. Unfold. Fred? 2 2 1. Well, well, what happened? After many years, the. No. We had this one. What? What? That's right. Well, well, what happened? Neither of them had the. the what okay, we have this one. We got this one too. What?
Yeah, what have hands. you got in the for Well, if you're not too dis- We're letting them go at fu- Gee, that does sound good. Almost- How about some- You're in luck! We've just received several boss- in their 20 to blue- That'd be great! Hmm. I can't- Once- Let's go with three. Three, two, one. Fred? Yeah. Well, well, what? In the end, she ran off with so a new the, one. What a treat! I know. What is it? They, I... What? Three, two, two. Well, well, what? Happened? In the end, the again, cheats. What is it? They, I, I... I need to understand what sense these are making because they must. So if I choose three, Harry, Harry, it says palm. Had told Harry that he was destined to marry a Let's go with three, two. No, that three, three, one. Wendy, Wendy, tragically. So now hearts. Wendy had already pledged her heart to a. I'm trying to understand. Friend. Well, well, what in the end, she Again ran feeds. off with the... What a that story. I know. Nah, I don't understand. What is it? The... They would... I, I, what? Let's go with 332. Is the game feeds? Well, well, what? All three of them, but the... What? That, I, no, we, we had that once. What is it? This... I have to... But, hey, you, I, see it is almost clear that we have to make a full body. Like a full pirates. And we have to start from top and go all the way to bottom. Then use the skin on it. So we need lungs or something. Or ribcage, something like that. Two, one, three. Yeah, that's right. Well, well, what? After many years, what, you, uh, what is it? That it's. How do you play? I play. You already I did. I bet I'm I'm missing the explanation of this. There's got to be an explanation. Three. Unfortunately, no, two, two. Jed, that's right. Well, well, what? Neither of them had guts. the guts to go through with this. What? Uh, what? Uh, uh, you, uh, okay. Are there lungs or ribs or something like that here? Let's see. Rubber knuckles, artificial appendages, faux follicles. Nope. Nothing I want here. He stole the hands. I haven't seen so many pointy things in one place. Sticking my hand into a basket full of hooks seems like a recipe for disaster. Egg legs. I make it a rule to boycott things made from endangered animals that I didn't personally kill. Maybe we have what we need. Maybe stomach or something. Second part. Liver. Let's try this. Uh, Wait, does it? Does it? It doesn't matter where we use them. I think when we use them, uh, or does it? Oh, it's now in. my creation is complete. Oh, we were just missing the feet. See? Now the creation is complete. Doesn't it look complete to you also, chat? Whoops. Well, that didn't seem to work. What? Make a hard save. Uh... <laughs> yeah, I should. Uh... Okay, thank you. Thank you for that. Let me... 
Let me connect these again. Now my creation is complete. So, um, we can't use the skin. Why? No, this is a collection of experimental prosthetic devices. I don't think that would help anything. 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 Hey, it looks like a hat. I don't think that would help anything. I don't think that would help anything. So why doesn't this work? Combine abomination of nature with prosthetic skin. Whoops. Well, that didn't seem to work. Why? It is complete and skin doesn't work. So what? What am I missing? Maybe I have to use this somewhere. <laughs> That's probably not a good idea. I don't think he'd like that. That's Why probably wouldn't not a good he idea. like that? He would love that. It's alive! Oh, what? Hmm, that was exciting. <laughs> no, it broke. Come on, it broke. <laughs> but it broke down. No. Okay, let's let's do this again. <laughs> it broke me too, yeah. Hey, I found an easy way to do it. I can connect two at a time. Now my creation is complete. Okay, so it's not quite alive. It's somewhat alive. <laughs> well, what do we need to use it for, though? Let's see. I don't think he'd like that. That's probably not a good idea. It's alive! Ooh, that's not a pretty. What can I do to keep it together? Did I did I, I use this like thing? Did I use it with grease? I don't think that would help anything. No, I can't this use is a hands. collection of experimental prosthetic devices. Skin doesn't work. Nice hatchet. I'm not picking that up. Whoever lives here must be. I'm not picking that up. I can't fit through that little door. Wait, what? Did I see something? Grass and all. Triangulation of crossfire. That's the key. I'm not picking that up. Uh, I better keep clear of this before I get accused of another crime I didn't commit. So I don't know if there's a puzzle here or not. It gives us some background information about the pirate that we are looking for. Then there is something about sticks. But w whichever choices we make, it seems to recommend the same thing, so... I'm back! So I'd like... Well, yeah. where do you... Maybe we need to make a walking stick with a duck on it or something. Like in his story. Back and forth on the deck. Oh, and how many people? I'll I sort of figure how long. Ah. 
I don't really think... Well, I really can't rec... Pegnos Pete. Could you tell me anything else about Pegnos Pete? What would you like to know? So you really don't think that a duck bit off his nose? Yeah, I suppose. I just find it... Where did you say I... I said that... Oh. So... You got sticks in your... He's Lucar Islands. Oh, yeah. So, eight hours twenty. Very well then. Not to mention, I believe that the perfect walking stick for you would be the Veeble Fester Nine Thousand Rainforest Deluxe. Gee, yeah, same thing. It's Freddy's stick catalog. Why would I want to look through the catalog? It's Freddy's stick catalog. I really don't need it. What in tarnation are you doing, son? Um, just looking at my stuff. Is that what they call it these days? Well, be quick about it. I wouldn't want any women folk to see that. What? Would you like to see my friends? That's probably not a good idea. I don't think he'd like that. There's also the perfume thingy. So far I've been able to add three, no, four materials into the bottle. I keep It's a little perfume spritzer with a bunch of stuff in it. I added uh, water, flour, what else? Two other things. I don't think that would help anything. I don't think that would help anything. I don't think there's something scratched into the bottom of this. It's it, anyway. Uh, we can we can spray the the prosthetic seller, the blind guy, with it. I think he's su supposed to recognize the smell. Come on. Dang, that's some weird smelling stuff you sprayed at me. It smells woody and fishy and flowery. Yeah, woody, fishy, flowery. So we cannot take take those out anyway. So I think whatever we can use on this is, is the way to go. Correct way. Nah, I prefer to keep this to myself and a select group of close friends. It appears to be some sort of high-tech file retrieval system. It appears to be some sort of... I'm not picking that up. Maybe I have to work on this. Pegnos Pete, right? The guy's name is Pegnos Pete. But this would be tough to brute force if I tried. There are 125 combinations. Let's go with three bananas, see what it says. I still think the symbols uh, all represent the first, second and last name. Possibly first letters of each. The name on it says Xylophone Y Zimmerman. It has all sorts of useless information, such as prosthetic prescriptions, address, phone number, allergies. 
Yeah, these are the last three letters of the English alphabet, right? So this is X, Y, Z, X, X, Y, Z or Z. This is A, A, A. We need Pegnos Pete, I guess. Oh, so I see. So this is one, one, one. This is this would be two, one, one. It's listed alphabetically, right? Okay, I think I, I see. So 555 was the last name in the list. The name on it says Harry D. Back. Yeah. Okay, we are at H. Can't go further. The name on it, Melvin D. Deuteronomy. It has all sorts of useless information. Yeah, we can still go further. Let's try four. I think we will be past P now, though. The name on it says, Oliver C. Deuteronomy. It has all sorts of useless information. No, we are still not there. Okay, let's let's try. Um, let's try four three one. We are pretty close to P. Actually, I don't know. We don't know the pirate's real name either, so that's another problem. The name hey, on hey, it says, Ryan hello, J. Dan Dan It has all sorts of useless information. Wait, I I missed the name. What was it? Ryan. So we are past it. Let's go with four two one. Sure, Jenny. Sure. No worries at all. The name on it says Salmon F Discotech. It has all sorts of useless information, such as prosthetic prescriptions, address. Was that really Ryan? Okay, that's confused me. Um How how can it how can it be? So let's try four one two. The name on it's Newton D. Erroneous. It has all sorts of useless information, such as prosthetic prescriptions. It's not working. No, wait. Well, how can that be? Okay, my, my first theory is flawed. The name on it, Kesko B Monkey Biter. It has all. So this is right after P. Can I go back if I turn this? The name on it, Norbert F Jamalam. It has all. We are right around P, assuming that's the letter we need to find. 
The name of Quetzalcoatl J. Izzleton. It has all sorts of useless information. Yeah, back to Q. Okay, this doesn't work exactly how I thought. The name on it, Sam and Max. It has all sorts of use. Also, the monkey would be seeing the parts that faces that side, right? The other side of the counter. Or is it the top? Or am I am I overthinking it again? Not that it matters anyway. It makes no difference. Let's try this. The name on it, Rhubarb J Sharkbait. It has also... Okay. We are at R. No, this won't work, I think. The name on it, Oleander M Zanubia. It has all sorts of useless information, such as... Yeah, this is before P. What was this? The name of Ryan J. Dance with Wolves. It Ryan. Has D. Hmm. The name on it, Paul K. Shu. It has all sorts of useless information. So we are at P. Right now. Let's try changing this. The name on it is Peter P. Eater. It has all sorts of useless information, Peter, Peter. such as prosthetic. Yeah, I think we are very close. The name on it Pagliacci V. S. It has all sorts. Pagliacci. The name on it says Newton D. It has okay. This is wrong. So Peter P. Eater. This was right. This was Peter P. Eater. Peter P. Eater. The name Peter P. Eater. It has also. Let's try changing this. Maybe it is from the right side to the left. Because the monkey would see it from left to right. Reverse of what we see. The name on it's Yehudi P everywhere. What? It has all sorts Yehudi P everywhere. Oh, P-E, P-E.
So both the name have... on it's Amy S. Happy Go Lucky. It has all sorts. S H. Now it's S H. S H. So Ash. The name on Fred N. Fragglestone. It has all sorts of useless information. FNF. F N F. What do we need? Pig nose Pete? Is it the name? To what was P? Monkey was P, right? So it's got to be one of these, like peg something Pete. Wait, was monkey even P? The name on Rich T. It has. Which one was Peter? No, Peter P. Eater was monkey, monkey something, right? Or was it not? Okay, I forgot. And I completely confused myself again. Maybe I'm looking for the wrong name. The name Niles D. It has. Niles D. Rio. Okay, this doesn't make sense. The name on it, Pizzicato G Positron. It has okay, all PGP. sorts of PGP is still something close to what I'm looking for. I need P and P, right? The name on it's Rhubarb J Sharkbait. It has all sorts. The name on it's rhubarb. It has all sorts. Let's try to learn the name again. Dave. I'm still looking. Not that I know. Oh, that's of course. Even if I knew the pirate without Pongo, I would. See you later. Since Kybras says we don't know the pirate's name, the name that the walking stick guy gives us is not the real name. Let's talk to hey everyone. Money. Where are you in? When are you gonna inspect a car? So eat. Why aren't the insp- The one you look kind of- I did- I don't know. Maybe. Let's- eh. Ooh, now hot up. Hey, yes, right. Hey, yes. Okay. This guy says nothing about the pirates. Pete the nose bag. It's possible. Um, yes, what is we Did you hear which Henderson versus St. Carbuncle versus Heaven? There's a lot of case. Wow, this... why don't sharks? Who says sharks don't eat Lloyd? Oh, but sharks eat Lloyd once they've signed all the appropriate corpus delecti waivers. What do you call a terrible track? A horrible back. waste? A potential hey. negligence litigation gold mine? Arisa by Johnny underscore Isle. I don't Johnny, get it. thank you for the resub. Thank you so much. Well, please. I appreciate the support. Hell yeah. Law practice. The law of the. The law of the. Statutes and regulations. Practicing law in the. Confusion through. Where are my briefs? 
So there's another thing. Um, I don't know if it's related to this small barrel, but hell yeah, we can actually try to enter the bank from the window if we have some elevation. Like that small barrel would be a good idea. If only I could get up to that window. I can't reach that window standing down here on the ground. I don't think that needs a fake arm. I think it needs a fake arm. Why wouldn't it need a fake arm? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. What? That's greasy enough as it is. Is it? I don't really need to wipe that. Okay. So we have to find something to step on. Like a seat or that or that barrel. But Gaibra says the customers would need something else to sit on. Well yeah. So maybe we switch it with something? But that would defeat the purpose, right? If we have something to switch it with, then we could also use it to climb the window. What are you doing? Oh, there are some portraits there. Okay. I'm back. So you. Peg Nose Pete. Could you tell me anything else about Peg Nose Pete? What would you like to know? So who is Pe You got sticks in. He's Lucar Island's uncatchable. Oh, yeah. Where I said. Oh, yeah. So. Yeah, I just. Uh, make Look, this guy knew a lot about Pegnos Street, but he's not telling the story again. So I guess it was a one time thing, which makes me think it was so not. so many to choose from. Like, it was not really so important. Many to choose because from. if it was actually important, then the game would. Repeat There's it. so many to choose from. Like, For those who so cannot remember. Like me. It is very important to choose a walking stick that fits your body, lifestyle, and temperament. Your walking stick should be no more than waist high and hefty enough to support 50% of your body weight. Active people should choose a stick that corresponds with the type of activity. Boring. I guess I don't want a walking stick that bad. Abacus. This must be Freddy's calculator. Pirates don't need calculators. Besides, it's not yours to take, Sonny. What do you mean? Everything is mine. Just another barrel? I don't think there are any sticks I want in that barrel. I don't think there are any sticks I want in that barrel. There's so many to choose from. I can't decide. Still a barrel of sticks. There's so many to choose from. Looking at these ones... Also, the pickup is the default option for this. It feels like I have to pick up a stick. Then I can go here to read about how to choose the right stick. We get Skybras is boring. And this guy only recommends the same thing over and over. Not to mention we don't have any money, so... I don't know. There's another person who knows a lot about the Pegnos, or at least knows a bit. And he's the bait shop guy. Wait, is there something here? Look at it's the a park. Quaint little park. I uh, would go back there, but uh, I really don't want to. Yeah. Ah, there's nothing like the smell of buckets upon buckets of was rotting that, fish in the morning sun. Was that the writers finding an excuse for Guybrush not going there? Because they don't actually make the area. 
You're back, eh? Candor If that's fresh, I don't want to. Excuse me. Yes? Do you know anything about a... Mm. Well, that sounds See? like Peg Nose Pete. You know him? Are you kidding? Everyone on Luker Island is hide a Peg Nose Pete. Where did you say I can find him? Are you dead? I said... Not unless you navigate the coast, Mr. Time Marsh. Oh, yeah. I forgot. Where are you? I not oh yeah. okay. So this this person gives us a name and we can query that name with the walking stick guy. But we still cannot give the name to the prosthetics guy. Well But maybe that that should not stop us from looking for the name. But it's it's two words. Not three. I like Maybe I have to find the name somewhere in the marshes while walking randomly. Or rafting randomly, I suppose. Because there are a few screens that we can get to. I want to actually explore these parts properly. Yeah, that's the end of the pier right here. Yeah, I have. I have dealed Ozzy and lost. Full step standing. We can go back there. So puddle. It's a stinky Mighty pirates don't need to splash around in puddles. Do I fill this guy with puddle? I don't think that would help anything. That's probably not a good idea. I didn't think so. So let, let's see if there are any clues here. Got time? I, I have got time, actually, as a matter of fact. It's just a clock with a timer. Yeah, I use it. What? What are you doing? It's locked. It's locked. I'm not picking that up. Oh, do I have to break this thing or something? I don't think there's something scratched into the bottom of this. It's yes. a what a buttons are hard. It's a chess clock. It's just a clock with a timer. Ah. It's locked. Oh. Do I have to Maybe put two pieces or something and I'm not set the up. time to what's shown there. What do I have, if anything? I don't think that needs a fake arm. With what? Elaine would probably kill me if I... With what? I 
guess not. Guess we can't do anything right now. But I gotta be onto something. Oh wait, what? I, I don't think I'm making any progress here. Oh, now it's three. It shows three. There's no way I'll ever find my way through here without a map or something. So it's just ten to four. These swamps are confusing the bejeebers out of me. Okay, this this is weird. This doesn't make sense. Fifteen to seven. Hope I can find my way out of this place. Okay. Um, it's probably related to the address puzzle. Later. Yeah, he even leaves the clock here. Okay, good. I don't have to worry about the clock anymore. So what can we do something else here? Maybe can can we go back up to her house? Wait, walk to forests? Is that the well maybe it is? Scary looking fountain. That watchbird gives me the heebie jeebies. That fountain gives me the heebie jeebies. Everything that gives, fountain you the gives me the heebie jeebies. No thanks. That fountain gives me the heebie jeebies. I don't think that would help anything. I don't think that needs a fake arm. What would you know? I don't really need to wipe that. That's greasy enough as it is. No, it's not. That smells fine the way it is. No, it doesn't. I'm not getting any closer to that fountain than I have to. It might bite my hand off. Wait. Why did it say say this thing? And Elaine would probably kill me if I went around misusing this. So he said something about the fountain, not the perfume. I'm not getting any closer to that fountain than I have to. It might bite my hand off. I don't think that would help anything. 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 I must sacrifice the duck. I was trying to ask the duck. I was asking the duck why he said that. It's locked. I don't think that needs a fake arm. Nah, I prefer to keep this to myself and a select group of close friends. See, when you normally use perfume on something wrong, he says this. What a distinct aroma. What a dis- I'm not getting any closer to that fountain than I have. Nah, I prefer to keep this to myself and a select group of close friends. Okay, I think, I think we are onto something here. The perfume with the fountain. Not exactly sure what. Oh, the guy is still here. I'd hate to see the creature that laid this. No, I have no interest in trying to hatch the egg. It's nailed down. Poor thing. Poor ferocious man-eating giant crocodile. It's nailed down. Poor thing. Poor endangered giant wombat. It's nailed down. Poor thing. Poor defenseless giant platypus. No, no, no. It doesn't. It's nailed down. So there's a koala and there's a baby koala. It's nailed down.
gets nailed down. Poor thing. Poor cuddly wuddly giant dingo. Despite the great fun it would be, I'm not- Real pirates don't need guns. Of course you Guns do. don't- Well, I'll bet there's just more creepy stuffed relics behind this. It's locked. It's nailed down. Poor thing. Poor. Poor thing. Poor. Poor thing. It's nailed. Poor. Poor doom. I'm back. What do you want now? Why? I thought I. The carob. I and. But what? What a. I don't know. But what a. Ah. Uh, a van. But what? What? But what? What? Okay. Uh, is not. No. Other than the fact that they're an uncouth subculture of who make it impossible without worry. Not much. Ah. I don't think he'd like that. Who cares? That's the idea. What a distinct... Nah, I prefer to keep this to myself and a select group of close friends. I don't think he'd like that. I don't think he'd like that. <laughs> I don't think he'd like that. Let's see. I don't think we are supposed to use the abomination this it's way. It's alive! Hmm. That was exciting. It wasn't. So maybe we are supposed to do something to keep it as is, like... Like these animals? Then use the skin. That doesn't need fake skin. That doesn't need fake skin. That doesn't need fake. I'd hate to see the creature that. That doesn't need fake skin. No, I have no interest in trying to hatch the egg. No, I have no interest in trying to hatch the egg. That doesn't need fake skin. I don't think that would help anything. That's probably not a good idea. Probably. That's probably not a good idea. What should we do, Doc? You think so? Okay. He said, put me back. <laughs> okay, let's, let's talk to the police officer. Maybe what we are supposed to do is break our guy guy out of there or something inspector yes why don't you believe that peg nose pete robbed the bank because mr treepwood it's just not peg nose's style if peg nose had robbed the bank he would have snuck used a clever and would have been peg nose pete would never simply enter a bank wow good that means it's worth you're not gonna no haven't you heard not to make quiet but how do i <sighs> That's the real perpetrator. Oh, yeah. Yes. Now there. Now there. It's attached to the. Iron Maiden! Excellent! Uh, I have no idea why I said that. I can't use this. 
It says, Contra Legis Mari. I think that means. How's it going, Otis? I'm a victim of society. Sure. When are you due to be released? He'll be released just about the same time you prove your <clears throat> innocence. Hey, just because my captain is a notorious bank robber, there's no reason to take it out on me. Otis. Jay. You're not. What is it with you? It's a plot. People are to make me seem less fearsome. Man. If it's any comfort, Otis. I... Ah, go. I'm feeling. Would it help? Wait. See you. Got... Ah. Uh... Maybe do something. It's it's flowery. I don't think he'd like that. What a distinct. I don't think he'd like that. Phew, this stuff smells. Spray colon on. That smells fine the way it is. That smells oh. fine the way it is. Okay. But that's a default option. I don't think he'd like that. That smells fine the way it is. Nah, I prefer to keep this. I don't think he'd like that. What a dis. So maybe we need to put something else in this perfume. Maybe we are not. We probably are not done anyway. I don't think that would help anything. But I, I think, think I tried everything. Anything. I don't think that would help 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 anything. Oh, do I have to... Spray the abomination? I don't think that would help anything. I don't think that would help anything. I don't think he'd like that. I don't know. I don't know. Can't seem to find the break. Maybe we have to do something with the termites. But to what end? We disturb Gentle the termites. Player, at this point, you should be thankful that your computer does not have odor emulation capability. This place smells horrible. I mean, really bad. So bad, in fact, that- Hey, you don't like it? Leave! Nah, I prefer to keep this to myself. Hey, and a select take that outside! Friends. You're scaring me bait! Oh, it'll only take a minute. That smells fine the way it is. That's greasy enough as it is. Hmm, this requires stealth. Ah, okay. Come and get it, boys. <laughs> Look at those little buggers go. They must be real hungry for the taste of redwood. All right, that was a random. It's random just not soul. much fun without the. So you got the termites. There is more redwood at the prosthetics shop, but maybe the sticks. Maybe we need to unleash the termites at the stick shop. Make a hard save. Make a hard save. <laughs> you don't have to spend your points, by the way. That's a good idea, but I don't think these are the right sticks to sabotage. That's a good idea, but I don't think these are the right sticks to sabotage. I don't think that needs a fake arm. With what? That's a good idea, but I don't think these are the right sticks to sabotage. So I think we are supposed to sabotage the sticks that Ozzy buys, right?
That's a good idea, but I don't think these are the right sticks to sabotage. That's a good idea, but I don't think these are the right sticks to sabotage. Hey, hey, Karitza. Karitza nineteen seventy eight is celebrating with her right fifty sticks bits. To sabotage. Thank you, Karitza. Thank you so much for the cheers. Welcome. Good to see you as always. That's a good idea, but I don't think these are the right. Slowly making sabotage. progress. Yeah, painfully slow, you might say. Not for me. It's not too terrible for me. I'm not sure how it feels on your end. I don't think that needs a fake arm. As a person who knows the game. Maybe um, if I went to Ozzy's house. So I have sticks, irregular sticks. Sticks, irregular sticks, assorted sticks, more sticks here. Also picked up a stick from this part, but we cannot target these. Honestly, I'm doing really well. This is the game in the series, most likely. I mean, two was pretty hard. Two was pretty hard, but this is also tough. I think some of the puzzles are pretty tough. This feels more like two than three, I say. Tails was tough. I don't remember Tails. I I played I finished the first three and I remember they felt easy. I was stuck at the middle of the fourth one and I didn't check a walkthrough and quit playing. Full staff standing! Stuff like getting the clock from the chess players. Yeah, as I said, I accidentally sold that off stream while doing the other stuff. I, I happened to choose that option when the guy had the piece in his hands. Otherwise, that, that would probably take me a, a very long time to solve too. I don't think that needs a fake arm. Okay, so wh where are your sticks? Where's your stick? I don't think you'd like that. I don't think that needs a fake arm. Oh, cane. I see the cane. Okay. What are you doing? Stop that! What are you doing? Stop that! Hmm... So I think this is the, this is what we need to do. But do we have to keep him busy somehow? Maybe it has something to do with the fountain outside. I'm back. What are you? I'd like to take if you what would you like? If I win, nor maybe eight million pieces of wood. Fine. And if I win, you have agreed. Or can I do that while I'm in salt sword fighting? On guard. Touche. Oh, that is so cliche. No, I cannot open the inventory. I don't need to prove anything to you. I know I'd win. Not bloody likely. Haven't you been paying attention? I never lose. Now beat it. All right. Um, I will take a bio break. Two minutes. And I will run an ad. So be right back. If you are not a sub, um, mute the stream. And don't listen to the evil ads. But be right back. Two minutes.
I am back. Why are there parallel tracks, music tracks? That fountain gives me the. That fountain. No. That fountain. I don't think that needs a fake arm. Hmm. So we can't use it anywhere. We used it at the prosthetics shop to steal the hands. <laughs> Does it look like scream? <laughs> Maybe it does. That doesn't need fake skin. Are you asking me, parrots? Or I'm not getting any closer to that fountain than or I have to. Or Johnny. They might bite my hand off. What a dis... Right, I've of course. I've always scented perfume. Nice, okay. That suddenly felt like a good idea. And I have to try. I'm glad it works. So let's try here. Tales gets better after episode one. Did you not like the the first episode though, Jenny? Besides the fact that it's it was difficult, did you also not like it? Because I know QP doesn't like tales. And I remember liking, but I don't remember why or how much. <laughs> That's an all too familiar smell. I guess I can't complain though, since Zachary O. Big Pirate Man is my best customer. Zachary yes. O. Big Pirate Man. The man regularly buys prosthetic noses from me. Really? He's my, uh, really good friend. Yeah. I lost track of him and, uh, missed him so much that I made a little odor potion to remind me of him. Okay, too much information. I have a strict rule of don't ask, don't smell. Well, anyways, if you know where I can find my uh, friend, that'd be very helpful. Oh, yeah, sure. He lives out past the Mists of Time Marsh. You can't get through there, though, without the directions he gave me. And it's filed away someplace in my Philomatic system. Well, let's go get that file. I can't. Pongo, my filing monkey, ran away a while back. He was the only one who knew how to run the Philomatic. As a result, I have no idea how to retrieve the map. But if you can figure it out, feel free. The controls are right here. Alright, this was a big solo, I think. This was an important part. Nah, I prefer. Anyways, after Mine Calendar 4, we are going to play Tales, so. We'll see how bad or good it is, because I, I feel like I liked them. I remember, like, I, I enjoyed them when I played them. Zachary O. Oh, be quiet now. The name on it, Xylophone Y Zimmerman. It has okay. all. So even after this one, um, let's let's try. Let's try this. So I'm 99% sure it says to start with a banana. The name on it, Waverly Z Dunk. It has all. No, come, come on. The name on it, Waverly Z Duncan. It has all. No, come on, what am I doing?
The name on it, Waverly's, it has. Watch me do it again. The name on it, totally why frivolous. It has okay, we are going back. Um... Test this. The name on it, Xena D Warrior Princette. It has all sorts of useless information, Princetta. such as prosthetic. Okay, we are at Z. Wait, what was it? What was the name? I forgot. Okay, I forgot. I forgot the name. Was it Zachary? The name on it, Xena D. War. It has. Dave? I'm. Not the. Oh, that. Of course. Without. See you later. That might. Was it Zob? Z or B? Dave? Yes. See you That might. But what was the Z name? Sorry, but I want to... Like I told you, Zachary O. Zachary, thanks. okay, Zachary. <laughs> okay, um... So we have to go back from Xena, right? The name on it, Umberto, it has... Umberto. No, no, no. <sighs> I want to use my mouse. The name on it, Umberto. It Is has it too much to ask. The name of Yolanda B. It has. Okay. The name Ulysses F. Tough. It has all. C or B. The name of Banda K Zowie. It has. I don't think I have still fully understood how this works. The name of Yakov and what it has all No, this is XYZ. The name of Xylophone Y Zim it has all sorts. So this is like a section, like from U to Z or whatever, something like that. So I could try these 25 combinations if, if I have to, at the very least, to brute force. 
But I don't understand. So 555 five, five is XYZ. The name of Waverly Z Duncan. It has all. So now it starts with W. So we have gone back. This would be the first dial for the monkey, right? So it would affect the first name. The name on it, totally Y frivolous. It has. Now we are back to T. The name on it, Timmy Z Monkey. It has all. Timmy Z Monkey. We are still going back, alphabetically. The name Val Z. It has all. Yeah, we have gone forward. The bunny. Bunny would be what the monkey is seeing. Bunny, bunny, bunny is what monkey sees. The name xylophone. Why it has. The name on it says Zena D Warrior Princette. It has also. Okay, we are at Z. So maybe we change this. Or actually, maybe we had to change the third one. But we have done that, right? We have done that earlier. Or have we? The name on Carlos. It has. Okay, that messed up. I think. I think I'm right that this is the category from U to Z or something like that. So this is Xena. Go back from Xena. This should be one one uh, name before Xena, right? According to what we found before. But I think I, I tried this earlier, didn't I? The name of Umberto D. It has yeah. Um, maybe I have to go to that monkey. Because the monkey would flick it the other way, not, not the way I flick it. The name of Yolanda B. It has no, no. I think I have done all these before. All of these. The name on it, Ulysses F. Tough Guy. It has all sorts. Ulysses. Ulysses S. F. Tough Guy. Hmm. Ah, I think I get it. So banana for us is the category U to Z, right? So we need to 
put this one to the category that is A2, whatever. And we have to find O in the middle. The O category. The name Wild J Billy Boy. It has all Yeah, uh yeah. That that is that's how we need to do it. But it doesn't make sense from our perspective. I mean, it doesn't make sense from the monkey's perspective. It has to be completely the other way around. There are directions to Pegno's Pete's house. Weird. Looks more like a train schedule to me. I need a screenshot of... No, actually, let's write it down. I come to think of it, it sounds very easy. After the facts. While trying to solve it, there is so much else to, that one can think about. Okay, this is, this seems rather simple. We start with three. So there are directions to Pegno's Pete's house. Weird. Looks more like a train schedule to me. So it starts at 3 p.m. So we start at, we start Make by going safe. west. <laughs> uh, thank you for the congratulations, Parrot, and the reminder to save. So we just go what the direction tells us according to what the time shows. Is what I understand from from that parchment. So we start with three, we go west. Be right back. See some parts. So this is 135, which is south. Three thirty is west. Hey Guybrush, I need your help. What? Here, take this. What's this for? It's a skeleton key. The most useful item that you could ever possibly ask for in an adventure game. Use it to open the gate. Oh, you'll need this too. What? Um, great. A rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle. And this. Hey, great, a gun. Watch out, peg nose. If you're really me, then what number am I thinking of right now? 9,452. Creepy. That is the number I'm thinking of. I guess you really are me. I... It's locked. So 220 would be vests. Why, why, why should we open the door? Okay, so let's not open it. I'm not opening it. 335 is north. Screw that other guy, Brush. I'm not letting lose another guy, Brush, on the world. So, 415 is east. Hey, guy, Brush, I need your help. <laughs> no, screw that other guy, Brush. I don't care. So, it's 115. Wait, what? 12, 12, 15 is. Ah! Okay. Okay. Maybe I shouldn't have screwed that other guy brush. Hey, guy brush. 
Take the skeleton key, buddy, and open the gates for me, okay? Here, take this. What's this for? It's a skeleton key, the most useful item that you could ever possibly ask for in an adventure game. Use it to open the gate. And we were given... Oh, you'll need this too. Um, great. A rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle. And the gun. Of course, he is going to leave without opening the door, right? And this. Hey, great, a gun! Watch out, peg nose. If you're really me, then what number am I thinking of right now? 9,452. Creepy. That is the number I'm thinking of. I guess you really are me. Hey, asshole! <laughs> Open the door! <laughs> Shit. Instant karma. Instant karma, chat. That was instant karma, so... <laughs> what the heck is this? 445? We don't have a 445. Okay, we messed up. Let's we need to restart and open the gate this time. These swamps are confusing the out of me. VR3. Let's go west. <laughs> I deserve it. I deserve it. I'm not going to lie. I probably deserved worse. Let's go south. There was a similar kind of puzzle in Hero Heroines Quest V30. I should have guessed that's that would happen. I love it though. Hey Guybrush! I need your help. Here, take. What's this for? I'm you in the future. I need you to open the gate for okay. me. Oh, you'll need this too. I'm you in the future. Hey, great, a gun. Watch out, peg nose. And this. Um, great, a rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle. No way! That's probably Pegnos Pete disguised as me again. No way! That's probably Pegnos Pete disguised as me again. No, come on, Guybrush, open, open the door. <laughs> it's locked. I don't think that would help anything. No way! That's probably Pegnos Pete disguised as Guy me again. Brush. Open the... If I only had a keyhole to use it with. You have! It's right there. No way! What? Oh, do I... Oh, I have to test... Okay, I have to test Skybrush. I forgot. If you're really me... 93. 93, Creepy. okay. That is the number I'm thinking of. I guess you really are me. Thanks, Guybrush. You're the greatest. I know. Oh, I've got one more thing for you. Ooh, a rope. That'll be useful.
I missed the second line, the line that he said before giving us the gun. I hope it's not too important. Hey, Guybrush, I need your help. No, don't say anything. You'll cause a paradox. Thanks. Um, me? I'll try to be careful. What? Oh. Here, take this. What's this for? I'm you in the future. I'm you in the future. I need you to open the gate for me. Oh, you'll need this too. Okay, it wasn't. Hey, hey, great, a gun! Watch out, peg nose. So now chicken. And this. Um, great, a rubber chicken with a pulley in the middle. If you're really me, then what number am I thinking of right now? 93, was it? Yeah. 93. Creepy. That is the number I'm thinking of. I guess you really are me. Thanks, Guybrush. You're the greatest. Oh, I've got one more thing for you. Ooh, a rope. That'll be useful. Okay, this was automatic. Okay, so we go south, and this is east. Okay, we are there. First try. Almost. Let's see. I bet a whole lot of crawdaddies would fit in this trap, and I bet it doesn't catch many either, with gaps that big between the bars. No thanks, I'll get my- I bet a whole lot of craw- and I bet it doesn't catch many either, with gaps that big between the bars. I can hear some people talking inside. If I move closer to the window, maybe I'll be able to make out what they're saying. Like I said, I got the job done. Now where's my money? Hmm, this should be good. Hey, all in due time, my dear Mr. Pignose. Hey, that voice sounds familiar. We've only completed part of the plan. You've done an admirable job in getting Guybrush out of the way, as well as reappropriating the Marley family heirlooms. I trust you put them somewhere safe for the time being? Of course I am. I'm no idiot. That junk you're so interested in is safe and sound in my impenetrable cave. That junk, as you call it, may very well be the key to ridding these islands of pirates once and for all. Uh, uh, no offence, of course. Right. So about my fee? Later, my good man. In the meantime, the heirlooms are our little secret. Keep them hidden, and not a word to anyone. We'd hate to have my plan spoiled by an indiscretion. All right, Mr. Mandrill, we'll do it your way. But if you don't pay me soon, I'll cut your gizzard out. There's no need to be such a ruffian. You'll get what's coming to you. I'd better. I'm off to tend to my affairs. Now that we're in possession of the Marley heirlooms, I must begin determining how they relate to the ultimate insult. So, Ozzy and Pegnose are working together. After I deal with Pegnose here, I'll have to pay Mr. Mandrill a little visit. No thanks. If I need stinky old fish, I'll- Pegnose must- No thanks. If I need stinky old fish- There's no glass. There's nothing to open. There's no glass. There's no. Yeah, I'm not gonna get too close. Throw the back in. <laughs> get in there! No, no! Get away from 
Hey, you crazy duck! He really doesn't seem to like ducks. Watching Peg Nose's panic attacks is fun, but I'm sure I could do better. Ah! Uh, hmm. Okay, I have to do something. That will make Peg Nose fall in this trap. And then we are going to close it, right? Grease. Could it be Grease? So he slips. That's greasy enough as it is. It was grease. Go away, you stupid duck! <laughs> no. I will never learn the buttons. I'm going to finish the game and I won't have learned the buttons. So... <laughs> game. Thank you. Nice. I don't think so. You're going to jail, bucko. Well, Inspector, here's your real criminal. What's this? That looks like Peg Nose Beat. Let me out of here! It is. He's the one who framed me for the bank robbery. I'd like this anklet removed now. You've got nothing on me. I overheard you and Ozzy talking about how he hired you to rob the bank and frame me. Ha! That won't hold up his evidence. He's right. Do you have proof he did it? Well, not exactly. Then so, I will not be administering justice in this case. But you can't just let him go. Oh, Pete's not going anywhere. He's wanted for plenty of other crimes. Come back when you think you can prove what you claim. <sighs> All right. I hope I can go back there without doing the same thing. No, no, no. Oh, maybe we can talk to the guy first. Well, if it isn't Peg Nose Pete, the pilfering pirate. What do you want, you ponytail freak? So, the infamous Pegnose Pete finally meets his match. You're nothing without your precious attack duck. <laughs> I want my belongings and I want them now. Oh, no, no, what no I didn't brute force it. I figured it out. It was tough, but <laughs> it, it turned out to be very, very simple, though. I don't know how I couldn't think of it earlier. I figured out how the puzzle works and I got it. Tell me where my stuff... <laughs> This is your last chance to tell me where the loot is. Or what? Or I'll bring my duck in here. Ha ha! There's no pets allowed in this building. Or I'll boil you in oil. Oh, I've had worse. Or you'll be wishing it was just your nose that was missing. Big talk for such a little man. Or I'll start singing show tunes. Yeah? Then I'll sing show tunes through my nose cavity. Uh, or I'll ask you again. That doesn't surprise me. Or nothing. That's what I figured. Come on. Please tell me where the loot is. I'll really, please. Talk. Really, please. Come on. I'll... Be the sugar on top. How does Ozzy Mandrill fit into this scheme? I don't know who or what you're talking about. Yes, you do. I saw him over at your house. And you still can't figure it out. You're a sorry excuse for a pirate. I am not. I'm mightier than you'll ever be. <laughs> right. I'll let you get back to running errands for the wife. Ouch. Did a duck really nibble off your nose? I'm not talking to you. Yes, you are. Quack! <laughs> Quack! <laughs> Quack! <laughs> Come on. I'll Quack! <laughs> Stay here. Freedom. That was fun. Quack. No, no, no. What? 
What? Come on. West. Thank you. Thank you, game. I appreciate. That's a very... That wouldn't be very neighborly. That's a very slippery welcome mat. No, thanks. I prefer to drink rum that's been prepared by people with fully functioning nasal equipment. Pegnos must brew... No, thanks. I prefer to drink rum that's been prepared by people with fully functioning nasal equipment. No, thanks. Pegnos must... No, thanks. If I need stinky old fish, I'll go to the bait shop. There's no glass. There's nothing to open. It's locked. Oh! How is it locked? He just got out. I don't think that would help anything. I can't use this. I mean, just answer through the window then. There's no glass. There's nothing to open. Nobody there. There's no glass. There's nothing to open. I want to go inside. wouldn't be very neighborly. That's a very slippery welcome mat. That's a very slippery welcome mat. That wouldn't be very neighborly. It's locked. That's the door to- I'm not picking that up. Okay, are we actually not supposed to go in? But why? There's no glass. There's nothing to open. Nobody there. Nobody there. There's no glass. There's nothing to open. Well, I guess we're not going in. No, thanks. I prefer to drink rum that's been prepared by people with fully functioning nasal equipment. Oh. Guybrush had said I should pay Ozzy a visit after this part, right? Let's, let's do that. I'm back. What do you want now? Hey, you're the jerk who hired Pegnos to frame me for the bank robbery. That's strange. I heard that you were the one who robbed the bank. Ha! I overheard you talking to Pegnos in the swamp. What? You heard me. I know all about your scheme to steal the Marley heirlooms. Ah! Your puny pirate brain is incapable of perceiving the true depths of my scheme. Besides, you'll never be able to pin anything on me without the loot. And you'll never find it. Ha! I already found it. Really? You found Pegnose's booty showcase? Um, yeah. What did it look like? <laughs> it's very nice. Lots of booty. Maybe I don't want to tell you. Maybe I think you're bluffing. You're th let me guess. Yeah. And what did it As showrooms go, I rated a 78. It had a good beat and I could dance to it. Hmm. You're probably bluffing. But I was planning to take a hike to the showroom anyway. Hi, sir. Okay, I have to find a way to... And when I return, I'll have plumbed the mysteries of the ultimate insult. Don't touch anything while I'm gone. 
Grandpa Marley's letter mentioned the ultimate insult. Wonder if it's important. You wonder if it's important. There are more civilized ways to pick a fight. There are match dueling swords. Yeah, let's let's follow the guy. So he is he is walking in the jungles by himself. Hmm. The path ends here. There's no way I'll be able to follow him through the forest without some sort of trail. Yeah, it's a termites, right? You just have to learn the time it takes for him to go there, maybe. I'm back. What are you? You're let me. Yeah. And what the? It was one. With the power of the ultimate in. Don't touch. Hmm. Once I clear my name, I really should. Real pirates don't need guns. Don't. Despite the great fun it would be, I'm not moving any furniture today. How can we learn how long it takes for the guy to walk? Or is it even something that we need to do? Can I pick the clock back up? Oh, but the clock doesn't work, right? It won't help us with that puzzle. I'm back. So. I. Well, where do you. Amidst dense. Ah. Uh, and how many people. I'll probably. I sort of figured. How long. So, which one of these? Oh, we can. Try all three. Three minutes. You should try to pace well then. Not to. I believe that. Gee. Okay. I the correct and answer how many is probably not here though. How about a hat? Mm. Well then. Not to. I believe that the. Gee. I I and how. I how. Eight hours, twenty-three. There. Well then, not to. I believe that. Gee. Yeah. So I thought if we could figure out what kind of cane the guy uses, we could unleash the termites here, and maybe he would get a new one. Because he keeps breaking his canes, right?
I suppose we have to do something to distract the guy. Then send the termites to his cane. I'm not getting any closer to that fountain than I have to. It might bite my hand off. That's probably not a good idea. I don't think that would help anything. That doesn't need fake skin. I don't think that needs a fake arm. 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 I don't think he'd like that. I don't think he'd like that. What are you doing? Stop that! What are you doing? Stop! I don't think he'd like that. I don't think he'd like that. What are you doing? So we can't use anything on the cane. So maybe it's not just termites. Maybe that's not the answer. What are you doing? I don't think... I don't think he'd like that. What are you? What are you doing? I don't think he'd like that. Can yeah, we be creepy? Maybe scare my way. Tap dance to the music. He seems to enjoy it. Okay, show's over. It smells somewhat like hickory smoked fish. Hickory smoked fish. I don't really need to wipe that. I don't think he'd like that. I don't really need to wipe that. What do we want to wipe? So that it smells like fish? Possibly? I don't really need to wipe that. It smells sort of like flowers growing in a cesspool. What? It smells a little like fish snot. It smells a tiny bit like a corpse floating in a bog. It keeps saying the smells kind of like, like a lumberjack wiped his armpits with it. It has the faintest whiff of something nice, though. It smells somewhat like it smells so Okay. It smells a little Ah, so this is this is the clue that leads us to make the perfume. It smells right? a tiny bit like a corpse floating in a bog. So this is the swamp water clue. It smells kind of like a lump sweat. It has the faint flower. It smells somewhat like the fish. It smells sort of like flowers. It smells Yeah, I guess. I guess this is not useful anymore. So what do we do with this? As cool as it looks, I'm not sure what it uses. Or if it's even anything important. You know, maybe it's just a joke. For finding all the wrong items. Maybe what we actually need is just the skin. It's, prob it's probably that. It's just a joke item. Hey, stop that.
Does this remind you of anything? Not especially, no. I don't think he'd like that. I'm not picking that up. Welcome where... Yeah, yeah. Can Hugo interest... Odell a Chuck's... Oh, yes, sir. In a... Doesn't Hugo... Not... A... Although sometimes Hugo... And... And Hugo... And the decks... And cover... But other than that... Eep. Maybe we can offer to give the skin to Nonos, Agnos, to fix his nose. I use it as a leverage or something. I don't think he'd like that. Well, I think he would. That doesn't need fake skin. What about this? I don't think he'd like that. That's probably not a good idea. Well, if it isn't Peg... Oh, leave me alone. Being incarcerated is bad enough without... I bet you didn't realize that you smell like a combination of swamp water, sawdust, fish bait, and flowers. Are you getting more dates now that you've discovered a better scent? Why would someone with no nose need a hanky? Well, I still have drainage, you know. You know, we actually do look kind of similar. Hi, that's cruel and unusual punishment. Quack! Ah! How oh, no. this you I am... <laughs> Maybe give him the handkerchief back. Why would someone with no... Well, I still have drainage, you know. Hi! That's cruel and unusual punishment! Are you getting more dates now that you've discovered a bit? Ah! Hi! That's cruel and unusual. What do you want, you ponytailed freak? I've had worse. Ah! Why is he screaming, though? Why would someone with no no? Well, I still have. It smells a tiny bit. Okay. Well, if it is. Ah. So what's next? We have to follow Ozzy to the booty. We cannot follow until we. Do something to the cane. Possibly. So either we put the termites on the cane somehow. Or he breaks his cane and we learn what kind of cane he wants and we do something there. I'm what are you? You're let yeah, and what? Humble.
with the power of the ultimate insult. Yes, I am. The Caribbean. Don't touch any. It's mm. just tough to play. Once I clear my name, I really should find out what this ultimate insult thingy is. Since I cannot use the mouse, I have to depend on keyboard shortcuts. Path ends here. There's no way I'll be able to follow him through the forest without some sort of trail. Some sort of trail. Trail of termites. A trail of something else. What do we do? Where's the skeleton key when we need it? Come on, future guy rush. Give the key back. Manhole cover. So this was also the answer to the skin puzzle, but can it be used for something else other than that? I don't know. Sometimes the game, it feels like we are without direction. But then again, it was the case with all Monkey Islands so far, except the first one. I think it's always had a clear direction as to what you need to do. But especially with two and sometimes with three, there was the same problem. The feeling of directionless directionlessness you always have kind of a puzzle that you are working on but and one main direction of of course a, a main name like clearing our name is the ultimate direction in this part but details seem to be lost Dave It is a cool game, yeah, I agree. I don't like the art. I mean I'm I'm going to be honest about that. I'm back. So Why do you put up with that rude s You mean Mr. Man? Well, for one thing, if he ever pays off for another thing, barely a day goes by when he doesn't break his walking stick in a fit of rage and demand a new one. For a third thing, he's not too bright. I've been carving new sticks for him for months, and he's never noticed that I just keep gluing the same stick back together over and over again. <laughs> The game does look better than you thought it would have, but the character models look a bit naff. Yeah. That's true. Still, the art style isn't the greatest among Monkey Islands. It's not just the characters being ugly. I think the art style of the third one is, in particular, amazing, in my opinion. Anything else? Oh, sure. I can't think of a thing. Oh, sure. Okay, so we just learned that the seller keeps gluing the same stick over and over. Which means he, he doesn't make new ones. I'm back. So you. 
I like. Yeah. Where do you? I'm it's ah. And how many? Me and a few close friends. Could that be mandrill and the termites? Oh, definitely. Three was amazing. I saw the fake. How long? Three minutes. Well, not, I believe. Gee. Where? Uh, That's how long? Three minutes. You should try. Well, then, not to mention the new. I believe. The Gee. Same thing. Definitely. Okay, let's let's try the brute force. This jungle option, at least. Close friends. Well then, not I believe. Okay, same thing. One last try. And how many? Well then, not I believe. You missed, yeah. Uh, have you been away since you said you were going BRB? I recommend you watch the wards. I mean, there were some great scenes that you missed. Okay, I'm going to take another quick break. So, same as before. Be right back. Blah, 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 blah. I'm back. What am I missing? Am I missing a hotspot? Like, is there a way to keep this guy busy while we work on his cane? Why don't <laughs> you want more animal sounds? You're just gonna have to find some animal sounds from the games that we play. With what? I don't think he'd like that.
What are you doing? Stop that! With what? I don't think that needs a fake arm. Fake arm. So obviously the the shape being an arm did not mean anything when we were catching the termites. Oh wait, actually it did, right? We we did it stealthily, so to say. Yeah, yeah. With what? Can we look at that huge portrait and learn what uh, what the cane is? This doesn't right. Let's try to talk to guy. Talk to the guy. Maybe he will have something to say about the I cane being put you. back together. I think. I'd like. If you want you. If I fine, agreed. On oh. This must be a puzzle too. Yes, yes, on. Okay. It's landed to a brick. Maybe we have to learn the ultimate inside. Yeah. Insult to beat the guy. If I fine, agree. On so we cannot find answers, retorts to his insults, right? Because it's Australian slang. And he knows the answers to all the insults. There's basically no way to beat him. Except with the ultimate insult. Or is there? Maybe we say something else other than an insult. We don't know if we have any non-insults except for this one. Hey, look over there. I've defeated 12 people today alone. How do you know? You don't have that many fingers. You smell. Guy's good. You're not within cooey of... Keep losing. Haven't you been paying attention? Maybe we use the termite somewhere else. I don't think that needs a fake arm. With what? So that when the guy is walking, the termites jump on him or something? I don't think that needs a fake arm. I think that needs a fake arm. Can't find anything. I 
Hey, Catmas. I uh, I did get it to work. Yeah. I installed the GOG version, and I. I don't think that needs. A I'm big using arm. a software renderer instead of my graphics card. I'm using a program called DG Voodoo something. So it seems to be working probably. We did have a slight scare. We did have a slight problem at some point, which reminds me I should probably say. But it turns out it wasn't it wasn't a problem. It was just the character was taking too long to respond. How are you, Catmas? So another thing that we we can maybe do is if only I could get up to that window. Inspector Canard can't see me over here. Maybe we have to get up to the window somehow. Waiting for the lightning and thunder to hit. I don't think that would help anything. Is the storm over there? I don't think that needs a fake arm. I don't think he'd like that. I don't think... I don't think she'd like that. I don't think she'd like that. Well, let's think about the barrel again. There's a barrel that... I mean, there are two barrels that we cannot open. And then there is this small barrel that's... If I took it, their clients wouldn't have anything to sit on. That we perhaps have to pick up somehow. I don't, I don't think, think that would help injury. anything. I don't think that needs a fake arm. That's probably not a good idea. Habeas, habeas, habeas. That's probably not a good idea. You can't handle the truth. I don't think that needs a fake arm. We'll just buy all the expert witnesses we need. Um, yes? What is it? We're... Uh, who and... Give them personal injury. If I took it for a bunch of high-priced lawyers, their furniture leaves something to be desired. Two, four, if six, I took eight, it, their clients two, wouldn't have anything to sit on. Just object every chance you get. Hmm. Let's see what's inside. Hey, get away from oh, that. Sorry. I thought there were complimentary. You can't handle my strongest hmm. tools. Let's see what. I can't look him. If we knew where the body was, we could. Hmm. Hey, I thought there were. Who can we double bill this as much as I'd like to know what's inside, the lawyers would probably prosecute me to the fullest extent of the law. Let's ask for an injunction. Real live action movie with Monkey Island. They'll never know I mean, you have done. Pirates of the Caribbean. Two, four, six, eight. <laughs> Who wants to? It's pretty much the same thing. Mama? Except Guybrush is more handsome than Johnny Depp. That's that's about the only difference. Let me pick up this bench. That's not how you use one of those.
lag. I'm not picking. I'll let the There's a duckling on this. Must be the duck standard. I'm not picking that. The sale. Somebody's selling fish over here. Rats. It's still pink. No, we can't leave. Rats. It's still pink. You definitely don't want your child to be ruined again. What do you mean? Ahoy there, man. Yes. Good one. That's not an anklet. Whatever you call. I'll be free and I really. It's just when I find the real criminal. True. Uh, oh, I can. Oh, I see. Yeah. But what do you mean, again? What, what was ruins? Hey, Carla. What do you want? You mean Star Wars and all the other movies of the sequels for the old, old movies or something? Would be a good guy, Rush. I'm not the person to ask. I, I can barely remember any names. Since you're like what? Are you sure? Are you sure you okay? I found a. I hate. Mm. Whatever. Game lists. No, that's not the command. Try Carry on, Carla. Do I really have a choice? Oh, that's one. Luker Island Port Authority. I thought you meant the critical its list. I don't think I should get in the middle of that. Smart standing. pirates know not to get involved in domestic disputes. New critical hits boost. Ket Moss 1987 just boosted Star Wars. Knights really? Of the Old Republic. I mean, the game is about to, <laughs> about to win the world and be selected as the next game. But sure. Why not? I'm going to boost it after the stream though. I cannot alt tab out of the game. I'm running it full screen. So I will I will do that but after the stream. Weasel warrior. Maybe I need a hint. At least something to focus my efforts on. What should I focus on right now? So could could somebody give me a hint or maybe you could you could decide to decide on the spoiler chats on Discord about what hint to give me. It, I should focus on getting good. Yeah. Ferocious man-eating giant ostrich. Poor thing. Poor. Poor thing. Poor. It's nailed down. It's locked. I bet there's just. I'm not picking that up. Nailed down. Poor thing. Poor dim. Poor thing. Poor dim. 
Poor thing. Poor di- It's na- Poor thing. Poor di- Poor thing. Poor di- Poor thing. Poor in- Poor thing. Poor- It's na- No, I have no- I'd hate to see the creature that- No, I- That's probably not a good idea. I thought it was a good idea. That doesn't need fake skin. That doesn't need fake skin. So anyone with an hint for me? That doesn't need fake skin. 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 I don't think he'd like that. I don't think he- I don't think that needs a fake arm. So no one has an answer, okay. I don't think he'd like that. Nah, I prefer to keep this to myself and a select group of close friends. I don't think he'd like that. Hey, this smells exactly like- Use the colon on one of the stuffed animals. Are you guessing? What are you doing? Oh, you just told me the solution. Get mass. Why did you do it? I wanted a hint. And what is that horrid smell? You befouled my dingo. Ah, oh, crikey, look what you made me do. Now I need to order a new cane. All right, no worries. Still, thank you. I, I would be stuck there. I would have preferred the hints that I could work on to find the solution rather than the leave. exact solution. Yeah, but... Uh, again. I would, I would have preferred the hints rather than uh, the solution. Still here, are ya? I don't think I, I would have thought of it though. Although I have been trying stuff around with the cologne and the spray. Maybe I would have gotten it. It's a bit tough. That one was a bit tough, I think. The hints could be something like... I mean, I was already considering a way to distract, uh, distract the guy. Right? So you could perhaps have told me... Maybe you can distract her, uh, distract him with a bad smell or something like that. Where's the shop? <laughs> no, no. Barden style hints are not completely useless or unhelpful. They can sometimes be very abstract. Okay, I cannot find this stick shop. How am I failing to find the stick shop? <laughs> Slightly useless. Yes, that's true, Barden. Like pencil elephant since. Oh, there it is. Binary Exodus, yeah, that's that's a story to be told to told to future generations about how not to give hints.
I mean, it it was even more confusing because I Those I had found that sure no and I, I was guessing that. Pretty, my new kind of better be ready. It's supposed to be hex. Oh, it sure is, Mr. Mandel. It's right uh, over on that bench there. <laughs> Creepwood, thinking of buying a walking stick of your own, are you? <laughs> Might make you look more distinguished. <laughs> Quite like a monkey in a hat. <laughs> yeah, those are funny. Hey. Put that part of the game bill, was Freddy. really and don't weird. Don't even think about overcharging me, or I'll own ya. Yes, sir. Always a pleasure, Mr. Mandrill. They're gonna go stuck in the corner. <laughs> the part I was stuck with during that hint, it was that I hadn't examined the jars, the specific jars, at the wood lady's place. I had somehow guessed everything else, just not the jars. How am I still getting lost in this small, like, three-screen, four-screen town? Where are the termites? It's a good thing he's so gullible. Sawdust? It's a pile of sawdust. I can't use this. Okay, we, we are following sawdust. Good thing I had that trail to follow. Up until now, that is. It's disappeared. Those termites probably ran out of cane to eat. Now, where did that Australian pirate phobe go? Oh, there he is. I must have kangaroos in me upper paddock. Be very, very quiet. I'm on Nazis. <laughs> this ultimate insult nonsense has me uncharacteristically baffled. I knew I should have taken that class in ancient voodoo curses at the University of Toowoomba. The heirlooms must be nearby. Steve Irwin, I don't know who that is. Elmer Fudd, yeah. It's not so shallow here. I can just make out the bottom. Eh, no thanks. I'm not. It's not. Eh, no thanks. I'm not thirsty. It's pretty shallow here. I can see the dirt on the bottom easily. Eh, no thanks. I'm not. It's pretty shallow here. I can see the dirt on the bottom easily. Hey, there's a hidden passage back here. That must be where Ozzy disappeared to. No, I don't know. What's him? Hey, that looks like the Lucre Town Bank's missing loot. And the Marley Heirlooms. I've got to find a way to get in there. The bank booty and the Marley Heirlooms are in the cavern on the other side of this unbreakable window. Yeah, sure. I'll just break that reinforced glass by banging my head on it. That'll certainly mess up the carpet. Sounded like a great idea. Uh, no way. Who knows where these skulls have been? Other, uh, no, other, what kind of tw I bet he wasn't. Nah, I wouldn't want to. Nah, I would. Wow. Hey, 
Ick. Dirty dishes. For a master thief, Pegnos is a real slob. Ick. Ick. I've got... There's a knife there. Cannot pick it up, though. I already opened the drapes. Booty. No, I probably no. What an How do I open yeah, the window? Sure. That'll, the ba yeah. That'll certainly mess up the carpet. <laughs> I can't use this. Can we do this enough times to break it? Probably not. Okay. What about this? I don't think that would help anything. Oh. I don't think that. I don't think that would help anything. That would help anything. Maybe we have to do something no, with the My water skin is outside. Fine the way it is. That doesn't need fake skin. Hey, that's a specific scar. Murray? Guess not. <laughs> I actually thought it was Murray. Well, I've already got a skull. Murray? Guess. It's a skull. Murray? Wait, maybe this is Murray. Mary? Okay, Mary is not here. It's... I'm not picking up anything unless I know what it is first. It's too dark to see. It's too dark to see. Oh. Light. Light is coming. How do I catch lights? I don't think I'll be able to catch them with... How can I catch them? It's alive! No. Hmm. That was exciting. I broke my guy. My creation is complete. With what? It's dead. I don't think that needs a fake arm. I don't think they'd like that. I don't think that needs a fake arm. I 
don't think that needs a fake arm. Um, how do we catch it? Will they come to music? Come on, fishy. I'm going to catch fish with music. That's not a great idea, is it? I don't think they'd like that. What would they like? I don't think they'd like that. It's not so shallow here. I can just make out the bottom. It's pretty shallow here. I can see the dirt on the bottom easily. Oh, can we get, get more fish bait? Maybe? No, no, no. I knew this would happen. Only one per cus- uh, No thanks. I try to keep the number of large pointy things in my pants to an absolute minimum. Maybe I should have asked the guy about the bioluminescent fish. Maybe he would have said something. I guess this isn't the right kind of bait for that. What? Of course it is. Yeah. Well, I guess this isn't the right kind of bait for that. Okay, this is annoying with these controls. I guess I should wait here or something. Here, fishy, fishy, fishy. Hey, he stole my bait. Hey. We are too slow.
Maybe we put the baits into the shallow part of the water and when the bioluminescent fish come, we, we pick them up or something. Let's talk to the guy. I don't think he'd like that. Excuse me. Yeah. Is the no? I he has nothing to say. Nothing up. The concept of bait shop caviar scares me. The concept caviar. Oh, that's. I can never seem to bring myself around to stabbing poor defenseless little worms with hooks. I can never seem to- Ooh. Ooh. Where did the duck go, by the way? Oh, there it is. Posture check. Posture check. I'm sitting up straight, but thank you. There, even, even straighter. Let's save here. I guess this isn't the right kind of bait for that. What is the right kind of bait? I guess this isn't the right kind of bait for that. Straight as an arrow. Definitely. I guess this isn't the right kind of bait for that. I guess this isn't the right kind of bait for that. would help anything. Well, I guess this isn't the right kind of yeah. well, I guess this isn't the right kind of bait for that. Well, I guess this isn't the right kind of bait for that. At least it would be an answer. Well, I guess this isn't the right kind of bait for that. Maybe you, you use the bait with something. I don't think that would help anything. I've already got some of that. I don't think that would help anything. 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 Yeah, definitely. Can we lure the fish with fish perfume? Nah, I prefer to keep this to myself and a select group of close friends. Nah, I... What is the bait? I don't for really these? need to wipe that. With what? Elaine would probably kill me if I went around misusing this.
I don't think that needs a fake arm. With what? Use your imagination. I don't think they'd like that. That's probably not a good idea. I don't think they'd like that. How do I kiss these? I can't use this. I don't think that would help anything. I'm not seeing any related hotspots, that's the problem. Am I missing something, I wonder? They're very tropical. Ah, no way. They're very tropical. I'm not picking that up. I already opened the drain. What an odd collection of junk. There doesn't actually seem... Well, I've already got a skull. You, you are probably on cooldown, Catmas. Try again in 10 seconds or so. There's a third second cooldown to reuse a command. I don't think that would help anything. <laughs> Mary. <laughs> That's fitting. Ugh, no way. Who knows where these skulls have been? You're as evil as Mary kept us. Head, I mean. I've got plenty ick, dirty dishes. For a master thief, Pegnose is a real slob. I don't know. I never played this game before. So is is this anything other than Something that tells me that water is getting deeper and deeper as I go this way. He should be, I don't know. I have no idea. What am I missing? How do I catch the catch the bioluminescent fish? In fact, only the third one has it. Unless this one has it too. Wait, the Mary is in the tails, right? I think. I'm not so sure. I'm what are you? Not too.
interestingly enough, I thought Murray was more in the third game. It turns out it's only in a few scenes. It's weird. The way I remember it, it's like Martin Planescape Torment. Like he he would be with us throughout the whole game, but he's not. I guess this isn't the right kind of bait for that. How do we catch the fish? Do we actually do something with the baits? It's probably something else entirely. I should bring Meat Hook here. You'd like this place. Inspector? Yes? Why don't you believe that? Because of. Quiet, yeah. Because, Mr. Treepwood, it's if Pegno used a clever series and would have absconded with the loot without Pegno's Pete would never simply enter a. Yeah. Quiet. Ozzy Mandrel. Have you got any proof? I overheard them talk. Listen, you. I've been tolerating your quixotic attempts to prove your innocence, but if you start slandering the good names of respectable and powerful citizens like Mr. Mandrill, I'm going to have to seriously think about throwing you back in the clink. Do I make myself clear? Crystal. Mm. I caught- I'm in a- Quiet. Well, we're all tickled pink that you've managed to capture Pegnose, seeing as how he's wanted for questioning in hundreds of Luca Island thefts, but- you haven't got any proof that he's the one who... Well, stay up. Yipes. <laughs> Yikes. Uh, no. It really was. Considering they probably have different amounts of delays. Hey Carla, what do you want? Like what? I'll... So I think we have to enter the bank somehow to get the proof that's proof that we need. So we have to climb on something. Is my guess. And maybe that something is the small barrel. We cannot pick it up. Although I don't understand, it could be bad puzzle design or it could be that we don't need a barrel and we don't need to enter the bank through the window because there are lots of barrels just free for the taking on the on the docks. So if that is the puzzle, why can't we just pick up one of those barrels? Like any of these. They are not even hot spots.
If we need to climb onto something to reach the window and enter the bank, it would be cool if we could just Lord bucket! pick up a crate. This must be the ship shock shop I heard Mr. Cheese talking about. Hey, look, a lucky penny. It's glued to the ground. Are you serious? <laughs> really? I don't think that needs a fake arm. <laughs> Can we not pick this up? It's glued to the ground. It's glued to... Hey, look, a lucky penny. I don't think that would... In the crowbar. Fringe candidate! I seem to be at a loss once more. Not picking up anything unless I know. No, I'm not picking up any. I don't think I. Sh it's too dark. Fishy, fishy, fishy. Just, just grab it. Come on. Hey, he stole Nothing. my bait. Wait, I still have the bait. Oh. I don't think that would help anything. Use bait with surface. Wrong button got me excited. Well, I guess this isn't the right kind of bait for that. Well, I guess this isn't the right kind of bait for that. these buttons here fishy 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 I wish those fish would come over here so I could see something did I lose the bait now I did here fishy 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 He stole my yeah. Yeah. How do I keep the bait on this try? <laughs> well, I guess this isn't the right kind of bait for that. I guess this is. Yeah. I guess this is. Come on. Again, wrong button. Here, fishy, fishy, fishy. 
I'm not picking up anything unless I know what it is first. I don't think I should do that. Well, we have to do this. It's the only way. It's alive! Hmm. That was exciting. It's too dark to... I can't... It's okay. So, any suggestions? Any ideas? Maybe, I, maybe I'm gonna ask for a hint again. Not the solution, though. Just a small hint, if you got one. Maybe I'm missing a hotspot. Am I missing a hotspot? Does anyone know if I'm missing a hotspot? Am I missing a required item? There are three things no. here. I don't think I I don't think I I'm not picking up anything. I don't think I don't think I'll be it's something. It's too dark to see. Wish those fish would come over here so I could see something. I think that's the final result that we had never seen. I think we have seen all the results now that I have written so far. It's a little dead. It's a little dead fish used for fishing bait. I have no. It's too. Well, I guess this is. I don't know. I have no idea. One thing that I could do right now. All right, give give me a Hints Hydrate. about it. Oh, is it hydrating? Thank you, Catmas. I want something about the window entrance, just don't fixate on the barrel idea. Is he missing an item? Most likely. Uh, I'm not going to trust what the <laughs> Magic 8 Ball says though. I can't reach that. If only. I can't reach that window standing down here on the ground. I can't reach that window. I mean, I have to climb something from what I understand. Oh! Wait, is it the window that's. All the way up there? I can't reach that. Ah, I, I was always looking at that window, the one right in front of us. So that's much higher than I thought. How do I climb there, though? Right, so a barrel won't help help solve that, obviously.
Wow. Not to mention. Uh, on second thought, I don't think I. Wow. Not. Uh... I'm not picking that up. How how do I climb there? We climb this tree onto that roof. Probably not. This is not Assassin's Creed. Do we climb this arc? I can solve it without leaving that screen. No missed hotspots or items. Really? Hey there, money. Where are you in? Hey, there. Eh, no. Ooh, now I'm broke. Hot am I? Oh, that won't help. Me. I've only. You can. See. I'm a. Now I hot. When are you gonna inspector come? So even if I could afford, why aren't you? The inspector says that it's a crime scene. Then why? You look kind of. I didn't rob the bank. If that's what you're. I don't know. Maybe, but uh, let's talk. Uh. That's probably not a good idea. Damn, I thought it was a great idea. I don't think that would help anything. I don't think that needs a fake arm. That smells fine the way it is. Nah, I prefer to keep this to myself and a select group of close friends. That doesn't need fake skin. Hey, it's like a trampoline! Really? That's such a weird puzzle. That's 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 what you're doing with my Callen standards. I sure hope the <laughs> nice one though. Nah, I, I can't. Thank you, Pratwise. Thanks for the thanks for the hints. I mean, actually, this was not a hint. It was just telling me to direct my efforts at something, and that I could do it now. I, I actually prefer these two hints. You know when I was speaking about how sometimes there is no clear direction. It controls that light. Technology marches forward. Harry mean the jet thing under the manhole cover was supposedly a hint towards that. Pardon hint confirmed useless. Wait, did you did you give me hints? Did I miss your hints? I'm sorry if I missed something. Oh, in general, no, no, not at all. You helped me solve some great puzzles with your nice hints in my calendar too. Nobody can. No way. Instead, we hire our. <laughs> well, I mean, yeah. No way! I'm trying to clear my name of a robbery, not commit another. 
Okay, let me focus on this. That's the second most useless trinket I've ever seen. That's the second. Why don't they answer? Nah, I leave the home decorating to Elaine. I don't have time to read. I'm sure this is useful, but... What is Scupperware? There, now my bait will stay fresh. Okay, I guess we are going to use this to catch the... Uh, catch the bioluminescent fish. I don't have time to read. Pirate Magazine. Pop and in this month's issue... I Lion. really don't need it. Free scupperware promotion today. Just open an account with 10... Free... Just open an account with 10,000 pieces of eight or more. Ugh. Plundering... It's no way. I'm... No way. Instead we... Huh. What do you know? One plus one really does equal two. Nobody can You don't say. That's a revelation. Okay, is, is that Mary? No. I, this must be the... You don't even have to... This must be... You don't even... So was the whole purpose of entering the bank getting that... Getting that thing that we picked up? I can't go out that way. I sure hope the previous owner. I've got. I can't. I sh Light fixture. Did I? S that was scary. I actually got scared when this shadow suddenly appeared. Wow! Look at that shadow. What did I see there? Was it climb ladder? Oh, light fixture. Okay, it's there. It is. Funny shadow. I'm not picking that up. Nah, I prefer treasure chests of the larger variety. Ow, that's hot. Ow. I don't really need to wipe that. Oh, I have to turn off the lights and then use them. So, w what am I trying to do? What is my aim? Like, cast my shadow somewhere to scare someone? Is it because I'm using software acceleration? I don't know. Clearly there is a shadow related puzzle here, or maybe maybe I'm making it up, but it seems clear to me. I don't think you can turn it on and off from here. It looks pretty well attached to the wall. It looks pretty well I don't think you can turn it on it's a light fixture. It looks pretty well attached to the wall. It's controlled by a switch somewhere. It's controlled by a switch somewhere. Yeah. But it's all max. Yeah, for whatever reason, the graphics quality is worse than what we have done with Scum. Might be the render that I use. Ow, 
that's hot. And it's controlled by a switch somewhere. Yo, what, what am I trying to do? Am I trying to take out the bulbs? And if so, why can't I do it? Why can't I do it when the lights are off? I don't think that needs a fake arm. That smells fine the way it is. Nah, I prefer to... I already have something in there. Phew. Better close this back. And Elaine would probably kill me if I went around misusing this. What's that shadow? It looks like a nose? Ah! Hey, a prosthetic nose! Good, gross. I'll bet this belongs to that smelly pirate guy. The one with ah. no nose! I'll take that, Mr. Threepwood. Ack! What are you doing in here? I might ask you the same question. Instead, I'll just take that as evidence. Let's go try it on Pegnose. No, this wouldn't be enough to convict him. Even if it fits, it only proves he was in the bank. It doesn't tie him to the loot. You still think I did it, don't you? Yes, but I Yikes. can be swayed by the right evidence. Now get out of here. So we are supposed to look at the funny shadow and realize that it's, yeah, it's, it's a nose on the ground. I wonder how Elaine's doing. And so, my swashbuckling citizens, as we approach the next century, can we really afford to entrust Melee Island's future to a man with no past, a man with no experience, a man who doesn't even seem to like pirates? Common sense says no! Hell yeah, Elaine for president. My opponent is right. I am a newcomer to these islands, and it's true Shut up, that Lichak. my experience in affairs of state is minimal at best. But it doesn't take a seventh generation pirate princess to see that Melee Island needs more than a part time status quo governor. Shut up. A governor who can't even promise her citizens good times and free grog. Don't believe his lies. You, you, you can't be stupid enough to believe that Charles is just going to give you free grog and good times, can you? You overestimate your citizens. Hey, hey, hey. Mom's off your time. Hello. Good to see you. How are you? Ow! Ow. Did you see the new expansion to Baldur's Gate 1? It is very different. We are playing a level 1, level 0 pirate as the main character. <laughs> Good to hear that you are, you are fine. Wait, where am I here? Our superpower is being able to hold our breath for 10 minutes. So, hmm. Here, fishy, fishy, fishy. Hmm. Maybe I should wait until they're closer. Yeah, good idea, guy rush. Level minus on Savage Butler, yeah. Here, fishy, fishy, fishy. Nice! You got our like wow, look at the difference it makes. It makes zero sense that it makes so difference. No. Rock, coral, rope. I already have something in there. I already have something in there. It's just a rock. I wonder where that rope goes. I think that's called Moose Coral. 
Am I supposed to spot the correct item? Then pick it up. Or is it the rope? Maybe it's the rope. Mary? <laughs> is that Mary? I don't think so. I don't think so. Okay, they are now again best two marks. I'm not picking up anything unless I know what it is first. I already have something in. I wonder where that rope. Ticket door? Huh. I already have something in there. Okay. So that was a thing. Whew. It's a good thing I can hold my breath for 10 minutes. Nice. Nice. Even nicer. Quadruple nice. Hey, something just fell out of the chest. A tiny screw. I'll bet it goes to Pegnose's prosthetic nose. Now I can clear the good name of Guy. Heck Street yeah, Boy. we found everything. Some in this wild performing yeah, exactly. Don't underestimate Guybrush. I think we've got everything. We've got the stuff. We've got the guy. We've got the proof. So we should be able to clear our name and um, leave the islands. We might be close to finishing this chapter. Do we have the deeds? I don't think that would help anything. What's in it, by the way? I'm afraid to rummage through this, lest I get my fingerprints all ah, over okay. everything. <laughs> Rain punch just to use oxygen. <laughs> okay, that's that's harsh. First of all, that's harsh. Second of all, how dare you? And third of all, you are probably right. <laughs> that's why we play for him. Oh, Inspector, I think you'll find this interesting. What's this? It looks like a tiny screw. I think you'll find it goes with a nose I gave you earlier. Oh, you do, do you? What makes you so sure, eh? It won't prove a thing. Quiet, you. Oh, did I mention that I found it with the loot that was stolen from the bank? Well, then, perhaps we should give it a try. He's a biter. Oh, still you. Quiet you. Well, I'll be. Well, look, let's see that screw. It doesn't fit. Quiet you. If the nose fits, you must acquit. I've never seen that screw before in my life. Quiet you. Well, all right then. I guess your name's been cleared. Let's see that leg of yours. Oh, um, right. <laughs> the anklet thingy. Hold on. Maybe I should do a background check on you. Just because you didn't rob the bank doesn't mean you aren't wanted for other more heinous crimes. What's me? Fine. Not at all. Quiet, Quiet you. you! On the other hand, without the stigma of felonious robbery hanging over your head, you seem pretty harmless. So, off you go. Hey, was that an insult? <laughs> shut up, Barbara, shut up. <laughs> What? What? Super powered ninja. Done paying your debt to society, Otis? Ha freaking ha. Time to make sale, shipmates. Thank gods. I hate this repressive place. Yeah, I was getting kind of bored. We can't. I have more repairs to make. <laughs> Just kidding. Ship's ready. Oh, but we are not done. No, are we done? I, was, I thought I was going to take the deed to the uh, lawyers. All right, mateys, stay here and watch the ship while I go into town. Yeah, you guys stay here while uh, Guybrush and I check out the flora. If you get to go, 
I get to go. Scumbar, here I come! Hey, if anyone here gets to go to the Scumbar, it's me. Yeah, you're the hey, <clears throat> please stay here and guard the ship. I'll be back soon. Jeez, we were just kidding. We were? This can't be right. I'm afraid it is, Governor. Charles L. Charles' Good Times Free Grog campaign has given him a 23% lead in all the polls. But... Honey, I'm home. Guybrush, uh, you're back. Yes, and look what I've got. Uh, oh, wait, that's not it. Oh, Guybrush, this is wonderful. Esteban, take these papers down to Melee Town Hall and save my mansion. Oh, Guybrush, I am so glad you're back. What took you so long? You don't want to know. Well, that's a funny story. It all started when I went looking for the no-nosed pirate. And then Ozzy said, I'm gonna put your shrimp on me body. <laughs> After that, I was attacked by an army of koalas. What? Days passed. And some of the lawyers used the Marley Mansion deed to drop the legal papers to save the mansion. Then I came back here. Well, seems like the sensible thing to do would be to destroy my grandfather's heirloom so that no one could get their hands on the ultimate insult. Whatever that is. I agree. Got a match? <laughs> Charles, you manipulating weasel. Get out of my house before I stick my piranha poodles on you. Yikes. No, no, my dear Mrs. Marley. Three poor. Is that any way to talk to the next governor of Melee Island? Burn him down, guy. Fresh. Burn him what down. The, polls say. the pirates of Melee will see through your tissues of false hopes and empty promises. <laughs> the pirates of Melee couldn't see through a window. They can't even see what's right in front of them. What are you talking about? Why, only the biggest lie of... Oh. Them. Okay, he looks very really ugly. Lechuk! Lechuk! At your service. Enough of this inane banter. I've got an election to win. <laughs> How do you expect to be elected once I tell everyone you're really Lechuk? Go ahead, tell them. Shout it from the rooftops. It will only ensure my victory. And once I'm elected, I'll use my gubernatorial powers to divine the secrets of the ultimate insult. Huh? You heard me. The ultimate insult. With its unholy power, I'll make the seas run red with the blood of my enemies. I'll bring the forces of hell to the shores of the Caribbean. And I'll finally make Elaine my willing bride. <laughs> Obviously, it's oh, shape changing. Yeah? Well, you fight like a cow. When did he learn to shape change? That's what I would like to know. I'm confused. About what? What is the ultimate insult? And why are LeChuck and Ozzy Mandrill after it? I don't know. How can LeChuck be alive? Relatively speaking, of course. I don't know. Well, I've got a plan. I know I'm going to regret asking this, but what is it? <laughs> Why don't I run for the governor while you try to figure out the mysteries of the ultimate insult? Why don't I run for governor while you try to figure out the mysteries of the ultimate insult? Hmm. That's close, but I've got a better idea. I'll redouble my efforts to keep LeChuck out of the governor's mansion, which should be a lot easier now that I know he's really an evil undead demon from heck. In the meantime, why don't you do everything you can to stop Ozzy and LeChuck from getting their hands on the ultimate insult? Whatever that is. Uh, okay. How? If I were you, honey, I'd talk to the voodoo lady. She always seems to know about these things. But... Have fun fighting the bad guy, schnookums. So this is what it's like being a first lady. <laughs> we still have this guy. <laughs> this is useless, right? It's got to be useless. Wow, this chest is filled with all kinds of valuable junk. I don't think that would help anything. I have no idea what to do with this. Maybe someone else does. Would lady had better help you and that fella? Maybe, maybe. 
What a strange lamp. I mean, you can... The way I think... You can finish Lucre Island without taking all those pieces. It's got to be a joke item. Because it's not enforced. It's not... Uh, gating any other puzzle or anything. It's actually very easy to miss. Unless you brute force like me. Possibly, possibly. Maybe maybe it's ne it needs to be used later. But I don't know. Elaine wouldn't like me touching the china while she's gone. I've got no time for easily mastered games. Sure. Really? Okay, nothing has changed here. It seems. We don't own many. I don't think we don't own many. Co If I want to point at something, I'll use my own index finger. You fool. Ah, Guybrush. I knew you'd return. How can I help you? I see that you are finally ready to ask me about the ultimate insult. Yeah. What would you like to know about it? I sense that you want to know what the ultimate insult is. Good guess. The ultimate insult is the most coveted and dangerous voodoo item the world has ever known. More coveted and dangerous than the indescribable terrors of Big Whoop? Twice as coveted and five times as dangerous. Yowie. What does it do? It is a powerful talisman that allows its owner to spew incredibly foul insults. Insults? That's all? I thought it would be a potion that turned people inside out or something. But these are no ordinary insults, Threepwood. It's these really are insults, insults spoken in an ancient, forgotten tongue. Insults so vile, so emotionally crippling, that they transform even the fiercest of pirates into an egoless mass of goo permanently. Wow! Hey, wait a minute. If the insults are in a forgotten language, how come they're so dangerous? Wouldn't that have the same effect as insulting me in Finnish? You'd think <laughs> that, wouldn't you? But the language Never used I by the I don't know if you're insult there. is so ancient <laughs> that it's rumored to be the primal language, the tongue from which all other languages arose. Amplified by the voodoo magics of the ultimate insult, this original language has the power to speak to the very heart of a person's soul and mock it into oblivion. Whoa. Indeed. Insulting in Finnish doesn't work, confirms. I see that you want to know how to make an ultimate insult. That would be useful. Sadly, I have no idea how to make an ultimate insult talisman. That's strange. You've always seemed to be the master of all things voodoo-like. Yes, but the ultimate insult was outlawed dozens of years ago in the aftermath of a terrible battle between two ultimate insult-wielding hoon guns Choo. that shattered the egos of an entire chain of islands. That's awful. And bad for business. As a face-saving gesture, the united voodoo workers of the Tri-Island area agreed to gather up and destroy all known copies of the ultimate insult recipe, lest one ever be assembled again. Don't we have something in the chest? I see that you want to chest. know where to find the makings of an ultimate insult. It would be good to know where to start. As I said, the instructions to build an ultimate insult have been destroyed. However, I seem to recall that the individual pieces of an ultimate insult can only be found on one island. Monkey Island? Mm, no, too obvious. It was some other island entirely. Unfortunately, this island's name has also been lost to the vagaries of time. 
very well. I sense that you want to know the connection between the Mali heirlooms and the ultimate insult. Stop doing that! But you're right, this chest contains Grandpa Marley's heirlooms. Shwinky. Tinky winky. According to Grandpa Marley's letter, his wedding presents to Elaine hold the key to assembling the ultimate insult. But there's so much stuff in these heirlooms that it's hard to separate the presents from the junk. Ah, I sense powerful voodoo forces at work here. Weddings, nuptials, bands of gold. Reveal to us a gift that's old. Hey, a pair of earrings. Lacy veils and prenups too. Show us the symbol of something new. Ooh, a necklace. Bridesmaids tinged with jealous sorrow bring to light a present borrowed. A pen on a chain? What kind of present is that? One heart beats where once were two. The final gift is something blue. Oh, the final gift is something blue. Is something wrong? Yes. There should be a fourth wedding gift in here. A blue wedding gift. But my mystic senses detect nothing. Maybe it's still on Luker Island. I don't think so. My voodoo instincts tell me it's somewhere on Mele Island. How curious. Do you have any idea where I can find the blue wedding present? Only that it's somewhere on Melee Island. What am I supposed to do with the wedding presents? If Grandpa Marley was telling the truth, they hold the key to finding the ultimate insult. But how? If it were me, I'd find the woman who wore those earrings. I don't need any more of your enigmatic hoodoo right now. As you wish, Guybrush. I'll be here later if you Elaine? need Elaine? You mean the woman who wore their earrings? Could be Elaine. Something stuck with me though. Remember the... Shinokums? What is it, dear? I'm kind of busy the right now. The mermaid or whatever in front of our ship. She had uh, pierced ears, right? Maybe earrings is something related to that. What should I be doing now? Now that you know what the ultimate insult is, you need to find it so it can be safely disposed of. I talked to the voodoo lady about the ultimate insult. Well, what did she say? She said it was an ancient voodoo talisman capable of permanently shattering the souls of pirates. Yikes! Huh. I wonder a couple of warped cretins like LeChuck and Ozzy want to get their hands on it. Want to hear any more about the ultimate insult? Only if you're going to tell me that it's been found and destroyed. Uh, um, not yet, no. Then, I don't want to hear it. The voodoo lady found Grandpa Marley's wedding gifts. Really? Let me see. Ugh, what was my grandfather thinking? His earrings, they're way too big and they're made of wood. The necklace is okay, I guess. See, they're yeah, made of wood. looks like it was stolen from a bank. Hmm. Maybe these gifts really do hold the secret of the ultimate insult. They clearly weren't intended to be proper wedding gifts. Pen looked like it was stolen from a bank. What? What you did she say about the other? No, put them to good use finding the all they do for me. It's times like this. Well, try not to get killed. I don't think that would help anything. This pen says Second Bank of Lucre on it. Second it Bank of Lucre. It must have fallen okay. into the chest during the robbery. I'd hate to think that Grandpa Marley stole it. This pen says Second. It must have fallen into the chest during the robbery. I'd hate to think that Grandpa Marley stole it. This necklace looks new. I wonder how I got in with the rest of these old heirlooms. They're a pair of old wooden earrings, and they're pink. Yeah, they are pink too. It's gotta be the ship mast. It has recently it's wood, come to my attention pink. that my opponent, Charles L. Charles. Those things really don't go together. What? Who? 
What? Where? Oh, cripes, not again. <laughs> Couldn't just leave me alone, could you? Most pirates would be happy with a gorgeous and animate figurehead. But no, you had to stick those accursed voodoo earrings into me. Well, here I am, an enchanted, talking, ticked-off figurehead. Am I everything you hoped for? Hey, a talking figurehead. Hey, a talking monkey. Well, actually, I'm a mighty pirate captain. Besides, there's no such thing as a talking monkey. Says you. I've been everywhere in this cesspool of a tropical paradise, and I've seen everything. Much more than some grog light swilling nobody like you. Um, okay. Well, I'll talk to you later. Suits me fine. Hey! Who painted me pink? What the heck? Um, figurehead lady? What? What horrible abomination of nature gave you the ability to talk? Damnedest thing. I cross tax with some old sea hag of a ship. How was I supposed to know she was carrying a cargo hold of voodoo root? So, a bunch of mojo crap fell off her decks and I sailed right through it. Next thing you know, I'm talking. Like you care anyway, squid for brains. You look kind of familiar. Perhaps you've seen me in your nightmares. No, I don't think so. Yes, you have. Watch this. I'm the king of the world! Woo! Ah! Stop! That's the scariest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> What's that? Is that Titanic reference? Is this game after Titanic? What year was Titanic? <laughs> What's with the surly attitude? You'd be surly too if you're screwed to the stem of a ship. Good point. Want to be my official ship? Want to be my anchor? Did you mean that in the literal sense or the figurative? How's this so. for clarity? Make like a jellyfish and dry up on the beach. Wow. I'd make a better captain. How long were you a bellhop before you got promoted? <laughs> no, I guess I don't want to be an anchor. Well then buzz off, son. You're blocking my view. How about dropping this subject, toilet brush three bowl? What the heck? You could learn um, something about this, something what? from this, this lady. Ever heard of a voodoo talisman called the ultimate insult? Sure. What of it? Do you know where it is? Nope. Do you know what it looks like? Nope. I've heard it can emasculate the toughest of pirates. Really? Are you sure you've heard of it? I've never heard of your stupid ultra mint insult thing. I was just yanking your chain hard. I'm looking for something. She's blue. annoying. We're all looking for something, Rat Dander. But this is important. I need something blue, like a bride would wear at her wedding. And you would make a lovely bride. Not for me. It would have been for my wife. I can't help you, but I'll bet she's pretty blue now. Oh, scrub off now, would you? Um. What? Oh, scrub off. So what? What are we supposed to do with her? I don't think she'd like that. She won't take it. A statuesque lady of your beauty should have a necklace. Oh, how sweet. You remind me of the daughter your parents never had. Really? Um, necklace goes that soon? Oh, scrub. I don't think she'd like that. I don't think she'd like that. What is this compulsion you have to dress me up, you pantaloon freak? What? We've used everything on her. It's pink. And we also find we also have to find the blue thing and use it on her too. It kinda is familiar to me too, but I, I wouldn't claim to know that I have heard it before. Because I'm so terrible of this kind of thing. But yeah, it is it is familiar. Uh, 
Pamela Atlan. What else has she done? Something we might have heard of or something? I'm not picking that up. I can't use this. Yeah, I wonder what that is. Yeah, I wonder what that is. Disturb me too. How can I do it when you put it like that game? More fun than a barrel full of uh, wax. More fun than... Why would I want that? Me too. What happened to you? I don't even need one barrel, much less multiple. He sure does have a lot of barrels full of stuff in here. He sure does have a lot of barrels full of stuff in here. Lots of things she's still acting. I don't think this would match the decor in our living room. Bobby Hill's voice actor from King of the Hill. I don't know that. Ah, uh, wait a minute. Ah, uh, wait a minute. I don't think I've ever actually... Meat hook! Guybrush! I'd heard you were killed by a giant clam! Rumors of my death have been greatly exaggerated. Not to mention celebrated. What? Oh, nothing! Uh, <clears throat> what brings you to my humble loft, old friend? I thought we could catch up on old times. Like what? How did you and Carla and Otis... Escaped from Monkey Island. <laughs> Same way you did, of course. On Herman's hidden pirate ship? Herman had a ship? That jerk never told us. I uh, guess we didn't escape the same <laughs> way you did. If you didn't use Herman's ship, how did you? Escape from Monkey Island. I uh, don't want to talk about it. Oh, come on. No. Whatever happened to your parrot? You mean the beast? Oh, he died. Aww. Hunger? Loneliness. A parrot without someone to talk to is a sad parrot. Yeah. Do you still do that thing you do? I don't know what you're talking about. You know, that funny thing you do. Come on, do the funny thing you do. I still don't know what you're talking about. You know, that thing you do with the talking and the face. If you don't want to do the funny thing, just say so. What are you talking about? You know, ah! the thing with the tattoo. Ow! Oh, you mean this? Hello, Guybrush. <laughs> That's it. Oh. Could you do the thing with the tattoo again? Sure. I'm Guybrush Threepwood. I'm a mighty pirate. Oh, it's not as funny as the first game. Not nearly close. Could you do... Sure. I'm Guybrush Threepwood. I'm a mighty pirate. Yeah. Uh, Fine I don't like mate. this one. What do you want to talk about? What's with all the candles? I use them to create me art. Your art? I didn't know you had an art. Oh, yes. As a child, I was one of the foremost watercolor painters in the Tri-Island area. See? Here are me old paintbrushes. Nice. I love painting, but after I lost me hands in the accident, I just sort of drifted into piracy. I didn't really like being a pirate, but what else could I do? I was a painter with no hands. So how did you end up painting with wax? Well, after me traumatic experience on Monkey Island... Sorry. I decided that I didn't want to be a pirate no more, and resolved to return to the world of art. Well, to make a long story short... Too late. One night, I discovered that I could create paintings from the wax drippings of coloured candles impaled on me orcs. Since then, I have been known to art lovers everywhere as Meat Hook, Master of Wax. That's the silliest story I've heard in hours. In hours. <laughs> Do you sell a lot of these wax dripping paintings? They're selling like wildfire. Which is ironic. Why? Because if you put them next to a wildfire, they melt. <laughs> the humor of the artistic elite has always escaped me. Do you sell a lot of these? This. Why? Because the I'm looking for something called the ultimate insult. I could use your help. How can I help? Do you have any idea what the ultimate insult is? Not a clue. Maybe you should ask the old voodoo lady. She's good with stuff like that. Do you know what the ultimate insult looks like? Nope. 
I'm looking for Grandpa Marley's fourth wedding present. Why? Because it'll help me find the island of the pieces of the ultimate insult. That's funny. Why? Many years ago, when I was a child prodigy using conventional watercolors, Grandpa Marley hired me to paint him a map of the Tri-Island area. He said it was going to be a wedding present for his granddaughter. Unfortunately, he left for Australia before I finished it. Where's that painting today? I don't know. When I began working with wax, I painted over all me old watercolors. I just couldn't stand looking at them anymore. I think I covered Marley's map with some sort of landscape. That's all I can remember, though. Do you still have it? Oh, no. My waxy creations are sold faster than I can produce them. Marley's map could be anywhere by now. Darn. So we find the landscape... Landscape painting. Then we expose it to fire. It smells and we get the map. Do you think that the map you painted for Grandpa Marley is really the fourth wedding present? It seems likely. And you really don't know where it is? All I know is that it's out there, somewhere, with a beautiful waxy landscape painted over it. I think I'll plumb this. Okay. Nothing. Thanks. So he moved this bucket. I don't think that would help anything. I don't think that would help anything. I don't think that would help anything. This paintbrush seems pretty solid. Uh -uh. I don't think he'd like that. I've got nothing to paint on. That doesn't need painting. So the blue present is supposed to be on this map. I mean on this on this island. According to the wood lady. Lua bar. <laughs> What's this? Great pictures of Grog! They've done something horrible to the scum bar! <laughs> Welcome to the Lua Bar! I'll be right with you. What is this? No thanks. Give me a Grog over this stuff any day. Is it lemon heads? I'm not picking that up. Pardon me. Yes? Do you know what they did to the scum bar? Scum bar? What's that? It's what this place used to be before they redecorated it. It was dark, dingy, smelled like grog gone bad. Sounds disgusting. <sighs> yeah, it was great. What's good to eat here? Do you like sushi? I'm sure I wouldn't. Mm, you need to ease into it then. Order something that isn't raw to start with, and then work your way to the good stuff. Good stuff? I hope by that you don't mean the stuff that looks like it lived in the bilge of a ship last week. Ooh, the unagi. <laughs> That's the best. You aren't from around here, are you? Does it show? When I travel, I try not to look like a tourist. I like to really get to know the place I'm visiting. Then this is the wrong place. You should be down by the docks, working the ships, drinking grog. That doesn't sound like much fun. This is plenty authentic enough for me. Thank you. Thanks for your time. Sure. I don't think she'd like that. I don't think that would help anything. So scum bar became a sushi bar. I don't think she'd like that. Sorry, lua bar. No thanks. Give me a grog over this stuff any day. Hey, hey, 
Don't touch that. That's an expensive collectible. Is is that what we need? I'm not picking that up. It's more your kind of bar. Why? You don't like Grog? Excuse me, miss. I'll be right with you. Why don't you have a seat first? I'm not picking that up. I'll just sit over here. I wouldn't feed a squirrel. What's the... There appears to be a minuscule meal set on this oh, silly square-shaped no. tray. I'm not picking... No, those chains and metal stuff look pretty sharp. I better try jamming it with something else. There's some sort of mechanical stuff under the water that's making these boats go. Come on. Darn. The chopsticks were too weak. They just snapped right in half. What is this? The boats, they are stopped. Uh oh, I better move before he sees what I did. Okay, do we go into the kitchen? Uh, oops, sorry. What in the name of Eiffel? Uh -huh. Here is the problem. Some smarter Alec has jammed the works. Nah. I don't want that recipe. No. To make the Lua Bar special alligator roll, take two slices raw alligator. Ugh. That's pretty gross. I don't think. Hmm. Hmm. I don't think so. Hmm. Brass monkey. Brass monkey monkey! <laughs> what? What's that? Hmm. Brass monkey. Brass monkey monkey! What's that? Ugh, no way. Who knows what kind of... So what are you going to do tomorrow night? The same thing we do every night. Try to take over the Caribbean. So what are you going to do tomorrow night? The same thing we do... Try... myself think and the brain never watched that these heirlooms are too valuable to waste on that okay what do we burn I I I think we are supposed to burn something in there I don't want to get fish to it's a pot full of fishy liquid Make the monkeys work harder. Maybe set fire to the whole thing. And Elena would probably kill me if I went around misusing this. Maybe I hear early. <gasps> Sacre fool! What are you doing in my kitchen? Looking for a menu. What are the specials? Out! 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 Excuse me. Why, hello. Great get up. What do you mean, great getup? Whoa, you look really authentic. 
Just like a, you know, a real swashbuckler. Do you work here? No, I am a real swashbuckler. My wife's the governor. I'm a mighty pirate captain. Whoa, you really get into character. What's good on the menu? Uh, I like everything. Really? That sushi stuff looks pretty gross if you ask me. Well, don't tell anyone, but <laughs> I don't like it either. But everyone else has eaten it, and you know, after all, isn't that what real pirates eat? I've heard the flaming scuttlefish is the way to go if you don't like sushi, though. Flaming scuttlefish. Okay. Did you know this place? Really? Oh yeah, they had real grog, real pirates, and real fights. Whoa, sounds great. But uh, what's grog? Uh, never mind. Enjoy your stay. Yeah. What's happening to the world, chats? What's happening? Hey, wait a minute. This little tag says it's pork sashimi. This pig isn't cooked. Ugh. Okay. That is weird. Can we not take more chopsticks? Was it a one time thing? And we broke it and it's gone? That's weird. Excuse me, miss. I want the flaming, flaming scuttlefish. Um, uh, miss? Can I help you? What happened to the scum bar? Oh, we're under new management now. We've done away with all the pirate swill and wenches. Oh. Rear pork. Hmm. I don't know. I like red meat rare, but or at least medium rare. But pork, I never tried it. But I liked the pirates. Oh, gross! Nobody likes real pirates anymore. That's so last week. But I liked the swill. We've replaced that old swill with family-friendly fun beverages. We have quite a selection. But I liked the wenches. I mean, they um. Made it so authentically piratey. Our decorators went for realism without the fright. They insisted that we replace the wenches with totems and bamboo. Drink sales are down, but we can turn the lights on again. Excuse me, I have customers waiting. Oh, come here. Excuse me, miss. Um, uh, miss? Can I help you? Can I order some food? Sure. What can I get you? Do you have anything that's cooked? Try the flaming scuttlefish. It's the only thing that isn't served raw. I'll have that. Excellent choice, sir. We're required to say that. Your order will be up shortly. <laughs> okay, uh, I think... When the flaming scuttlefish is coming, I have to stop it right under the portrait. Come on, you are too late. <gasps> uh oh, I better move before he sees what I did. Sacre bleu! I do not understand. Why do the boats keep stopping? What are these brushes doing here? Uh, 
Uh, oops, sorry. <laughs> no. Defeated by buttons again. Let me save here. Is it close enough? <gasps> Is it even the correct thing uh -oh. that we're supposed to I better to move before he sees what I did. Maybe it's not even the correct thing. I mean, are we really expected to get it like perfectly? Here. Is that perfect enough? Uh oh, I better move before he sees what I did. No, it's, it's probably not the not the puzzle. Sacre bleu! I do not understand. Why does the boats keep stopping? What are these? It might be that I have to stop it when it's in the kitchen. move before he sees what I did. One more try. Yeah, this is this is exactly perfect. This is if it's correct, then this should work. But I don't think it's it's correct. Uh oh, I better move before he sees what I did. Sacre bleu! I do not understand. Why does the boats keep stopping? What are these brushes doing here? It again. Oui, oui. Alright, we are going to continue tomorrow. Let's make one more save. And one more save. Let's try it again. Alright. Oops. Alright, of course. Um let's get Catmas's what was it? Kotor. Alright. Yeah, good. Um let's find someone to read. Who do we raid? 
Is anyone playing Minecraft? Thank you, thank you. No one's playing Minecraft. Islands. Well, um, let's raid Bennett. She's playing James Pond 2. Pod name Robocod. It has been very, very, very long since I last played this game, but I, I loved it. <laughs> Thank you so much for being here and watching. So I'll be back tomorrow uh, with more of this. Let's see how much uh, we can make progress tomorrow. So if you've not given me a follow and if you have enjoyed the stream, uh, you, you can consider giving me a follow to come back to hear about when I go live. Or even further, you can join the Discord and maybe even take part in our critical hit shenanigans for choosing the next game. I am, um, I mean, we are probably finishing Baldur's Gates next week, right? If not on Thursday, then probably on Friday. Hopefully, I think it's time we finish it. It's been way too long. Like, it's going to be 20 streams or so when we finish it. And maybe move on to the next game the following week which is being voted on right now on discord so if you're interested in that kind of stuff feel free to drop by and say hi otherwise till we next meet hopefully tomorrow be well and take care of yourselves and goodbye